Oh yes, my friends, it is that time! It is the blob dance time. Let me see one, let me see all, let me see every single blob dance ever in the whole wide world. Fill up the chat. Leon, Trogamal, Septic, Gamora, Cracking Crutch, and Ground Control. Welcome one. Welcome all. Thank you so much for coming in early. It is Sunday. Tis I, Subtequus, and the mustache has been nerfed. Same with the beard, but do not worry, my friends, it will grow back out. But for now, I look very distinguished, very short, very uh, controlled, very manageable. Still looks messy. Thank you. <laughs> How are y'all? How's everybody's weekend? Ben Leon, thank you for contributing to the dancing blob. I really appreciate you. Looks amazing, Gamora. Thank you. That is very kind of you to say. Very proper and dapper. That, it looks, it does look very dapper. That is true. Oh my god. This shirt should not be that open for free. I just realized. It's a linen shirt, damn it. The problem is, we're in linen shirt. This is too far up. If the first button was here, it would be perfect. Oh well. That's how your weekend went? Okay, well, there you go. There you go, Leon. You got the first button for free. <laughs> oh, you got the first button opened. There we go. Thank you. Thank you, Leon, for making sure that I don't have... Uh, whatchamacallit? Um, an, a suboptimal shirt opening button. I appreciate that, Leon. You're a good friend. Uh, what do you mean with your weekend when... Septic. What, what does that mean? What does that entail? Specifically! Suboptimal short opening? Yes! It's a thing. Listen, we don't got a lot of stuff to deal with in male fashion, okay? But the things we got to deal with, they're pretty specific. They're pretty, you know, you can min max that shit. You know what I mean? And. Honestly, I prefer min-maxing fashion over, you know, a broad spectrum of fashion. I think that's way better. Find your perfect style of watches, find your perfect style of shirts, you know, find your perfect style of suits, pants, jeans, all that stuff. It's, it, it's better, in my opinion. <laughs> okay, guys, do you know what's happening right now on the other monitor? On the secondary monitor over here? We are, um... We are uh, downloading the uh, the second Last of Us game. We're, last, uh, we're downloading The Last of Us Part 2 as we speak. And uh, we're just going to jump straight into it after we're done with uh, The Last of Us 1 today. Is, is my plan. Does that sound good? You booked a 12-day vacation in Turkey, all-inclusive, almost directly at the beach with everything included. Ooh, septic! You're gonna you're gonna get that good good vacation. I, I appreciate that. You're gonna get that good good vacation. That is very nice. That is uh, that is exactly what you want, really. That is awesome. I'm happy for you, Septic. Little, little beach vacation. Yeah. Hello, Halo. Guys, I keep finding more and more songs that has the same BPM as the Blob Dance, and. Uh, this is the memeiest bodybuilding song. <laughs> and uh, the fact that this song follows the blob dance BPM makes me indescribably happy. <laughs> you stole a bit, gotta run and go to a birthday lunch, and I don't wanna miss anything. You gotta watch the one. I'm sorry, Explosive, but listen. If you. If you. If you put your. If you set your computer, like. If you just leave your computer on with my stream up explicit, you will gather so many karma points while you're away and channel points for that matter but most importantly karma points channel points all most important is karma but i'm just saying if you leave that shit on lurk good things will happen in your life just make sure sure your bot uploads properly <laughs> 
You gotta take that up with Twitch, my friend. You gotta take... See, listen. How about this next place? Uh, as long as you promise to, to set your computer to lurk me while you're away, um... I, I will I will I will send a personal letter to Twitch and ask them to make sure that the VOD for today uploads properly. But I also gotta be honest, explosive. Uh, we finished the main story in Last of Us 1 on Thursday. And then we started on the DLC. We're gonna finish the DLC of Last of Us 1 today, and then we're gonna start the Last of Us 2. And uh, that's the plan. So if you wanted to see the final to The Last of Us 1. Uh, that VOD is in the library, already, for your viewing pleasure. Yeah. Mm. Oh my god. I'm at the point now where I just love water with slight flavor. So I'm using... I'm using vitamins. I'm using vitamins to uh, like vitamin water soluble stuff to give my water flavor. And honestly, freaking life hack guys, freaking life hack. I get my vitamins, water tastes better. So I drink more water. It's great. It's absolutely fantastic. Having a blast with it. Oh. All right guys. Are we ready for the feels? Are we ready for the feels today? The answer, of course, is no, but we're gonna do it anyways. That's just my personal feelings on the matter. And, uh, yeah, let's just, uh, let's just jump into it. Jump into it, shall we? I wanna, I wanna jump into it. And, uh, let's see, then I need to start the 4K. There we go. Passing out tissues. Thank you, Nanners. Welcome to the stream. <clears throat> feels? I'm a man. I don't have the feels. That's that's what that's what the lizard people want you to believe. Halo. Don't fall for their propaganda. Men men have many feels. We're we're just we we were just never told taught how to deal with them. Only rage. So you're so you're a nineteen eighties action action movie star halo jack <laughs> when it's like the love of my life died i'm not gonna be i'm not gonna be sad about it i'm gonna be angry i'm gonna be grumpy <laughs> burn the heretics but heresy is subjective oh my god guys look i'm already downloading the second game New men show the feels. Now, all men show the feels, Nanners. It's just some were told that they shouldn't. And, uh, you know, then then they die too soon. And that's sad. Also, that I judge a bunch was more for something else. I ordered stuff from EMP. Ordered a cardigan. Looks like a kefta from SAB and a shirt. It was St. Patrick's Day and had this thing where you can win your whole shopping for free. One in a hundred chance. And guess what? You won! Oh my god, so you won your shopping. So you won 88 bucks, basically. That's awesome. Alright. We're, uh... That's downloading. I don't know how PlayStations work. Can I play this game? While the download goes on in the background? I don't know. We'll, we'll find out. Subtech was you brilliant beneficiary of benevolent bravado. How are you, Jew? man you most magnificent mammalacious mammal of a man how you been we're not gonna start a new game plus we're gonna we're gonna load game and uh then we're gonna play the auto save because we're almost done with the dlc congrats on the engagement thank you juice what what Yes, I want to load this save data. Downloading and playing a game at the same time in 2023? What is this? Witchcraft? Yes, again. Okay, good. I just, I just wasn't, I just didn't know. Wait. What's happening right now? Continue, yeah. Strange. 
I just didn't know if that was something you could do on a PlayStation exclusive. Looks so good in order without expecting to win. A day later, I get the package and BAM! The winning ticket was in it. That is awesome. All being all lit up? Nah, the exterior lights don't work. How do you know? This okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna be clever about these things and I'm going to. Uh, what was it? There we go. Test manager. Then I'm gonna go into details and then I'm gonna boost. We're gonna boost the OBS just so we get the absolute best. There we go. Quality money can buy. Heresy everywhere. What? Firefly Melanie told me all about it. So, uh, when do you guys think everything is about this to go wrong? Fancy. Wanna try it? It's gonna go wrong while they're on the carousel, right? Yeah. You ready for this? <laughs> what are we doing? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Riley, come here. <laughs> now you got this. Go. <laughs> what the heck? This is awesome. Man, can you imagine how cool this is if you've never had yeah. something that is literally only built for fun like this? Dude, that's so great. Come on, get up here. Sit next to me. All right, wait up. This is so cute. Oh, shit's gonna go so <laughs> wrong so fast. <laughs> No, 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 no. I just got on. Live! <laughs> oh. Oh, no. Well, I loved it. So, there. Oh. I got something else. What is that? <clears throat> oh. What did the triangle say to the circle? <gasps> what is that? You're so pointless. Fuck you, you found another pun book? Well, that's why she was what excited about finding a pun book in the library. Um, a cold shoulder. <laughs> Here, it's for you. Hey, devil, welcome to the stream. Dude, every day is pun time. You know, you might just be my favorite person again. Just saying. I know my girl. Just saying. <laughs> All right, you ready? All right. She's gonna serve up so many jokes. Walked into a park. Oh no. One was assaulted. Oh, oh <laughs> good one. Go, go. I like how they're basically both going finger guns. Take it slow, explore everything. Oh yeah, oh yeah, explosive. A boiled egg in the morning is really hard to beat. <laughs> how dare you? <laughs> That's funny. That is funny. I like that one. I'm reading a book on anti-gravity, and it's impossible to put down. <laughs> nice. <laughs> that's, a, that's a classic. Yeah. That's a classic. It's not that the guy didn't know how to juggle. He just didn't have the balls to do it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> that one was good. That one was I'm actually good. I'm glad I know sign language. It's become quite handy. <laughs> that's silly. That's really silly. I forgot how to throw a boomerang, but it came back to me. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> no, come on, I like that one. Hungry, it goes back four seconds. Oh, oh I yeah. get it? Yeah. It goes back four seconds. For seconds. Yeah. yeah. I once heard a joke about amnesia, but I forget how it goes. <laughs> good one. She's got good delivery. Ellie's got good delivery. I just wanna I just wanna when say. The power went out at the school, the children were delighted. Hey! Mm. Oh, come on, that one was good. Those fish were shy. They were obviously coy. <laughs> oh, that's, that's, that was good. How many do you think they have? Those two men drinking battery acid will soon be charged. Ooh, that's ugh, dark. It's kind of dark. How many do you think you got? Favorite letter? Oh, I know this one. <laughs> nah, tis the sea. <laughs> oh, cause the sea, cause the <laughs> water, the ocean. That's Hello, Ellie Peachy. Welcome to the stream. Yes. It's very good to see you. Awesome. We're we're just watching Ellie tell puns. I'm inclined to be laid back. <laughs> that's true. I actually feel like that's, that's true. it. That's the whole joke. That's the that's, that's whole joke. Recl reclining. Inclined. Meh. Newspaper headline reads: 
cartoonist, found dead at home. Details are sketchy. Hey. <laughs> yes. That's cute. Oh, man, I love this. I'm literally just letting them tell puns. It's Magician great. Magician got frustrated and pulled his hair out. Oh, okay. Mm. Oh, like a rabbit. Yeah, lame. The frustrated cannibal threw up his hands. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Oh, seriously, how, ma how many puns do you think they programmed into this game? That's so gross. A criminal's best asset is his lie ability. Oh, brother. Wow, no. <laughs> Boo. I didn't have the faintest idea as to why I passed out. <laughs> uh, I'm literally just going to... about the guy who got hit in the head with a can of soda. He's lucky it was a soft drink. <laughs> I'm honestly going to tell every single pun until the game is like, once a cross -eyed no. Teacher who had issues controlling his pupils. Oh, oh that's that's <laughs> yeah. Diarrhea. We're, we're just hereditary. going with the puns, guys. Tell me your it best. In your jeans. <laughs> Finally, gross. a poop joke. Guys, oh. tell me your best puns in chat. All I right. need the best puns and dad jokes in chat. I'm putting this away. Especially now that this Two is, uh, now that this puns. is over. Now that we won't hear more puns. A photo booth song. Ellie, we're so doing this. Schmolta booth? Yeah, can you? I'm such an asshole. The other guy, my girl from a patrol. And there's this, and there's little Ellie sitting there next to my damn tent, petting my horse while crying her eyes out. So what do I do? I take off before she notices me. What the hell would I say to her? Hey, Winston. Hi, Ellie. Can you please stop crying? It's upsetting me. Thanks. Yeah, that would have gone over well. She's always so cheery with her endless questions. She had no idea. She's so sad and shy. She wears that mask well. I'm such an asshole. Oh, Winston, buddy. No. That's embarrassing. Poor Winston, man. Who's doing his best? How do you do that? What? Whistle? You just... Oh my god, they're adding so much to her fucking character! Oh, okay, you just... Oh, that's great! Mm. It's all about practice. Mm. How does this work? You just follow the instructions, I think. Okay. Should I do it? No, you know what? You do it. And off we go. Ooh, thanks. What are you gonna pick? Cool. They're having fun, so it's gonna be cool. What's cool look like? How's that guy cool? Well, he's wearing shades and he's a bunny. <laughs> Staying with cool. Oh, okay. Smile. Oh, they're so awkward. Uh. As an angel. <laughs> okay, something creepy. <laughs> Move in, move in. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, what do you call a sleeping dinosaur? A dinosaur? Oh. Well played, Elu. Squishy face, squishy face. Mm. Okay, let's make a silly face. Okay. All right, be all sexy. Ooh, so sexy. <laughs> oh, it's all done. All right. Oh, my God. The... the the bottom one is perfect. The bottom one is perfect. <laughs> huh, these look great. What's a Facebook? Yes, show on Facebook. Print our faces in a book. Enter a username. What should I write? Just type some stuff. Write your last name or something. Okay. We don't get to know her last name. That's funny. Ooh, Sherry. share contest oh, okay nah i'm not done i'm not gonna do that come on now no internet connection oh. what does that mean <laughs> no internet oh, connection what does that mean <laughs> oh it's great that's so cool oh give us some pictures oh my god i can't believe it's actually gonna work <laughs> i know oh Here we try. okay <sighs> what oh come on fuck you Put it up here. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, what just happened? 
I think we broke it. <laughs> I think we did too. Oh, that's that's cute though. Look at them. So. so. <gasps> you want to keep exploring? Hell yeah. I think they love. I think. I think. I think they. I think they kind of. I think they kind of like each other. Lady, why does she have to sound like such a dick? Hmm? No, right? Here's how I do it. <clears throat> Attention. The 6 a.m. shift starts in 10 minutes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, let me try. Let me try. <laughs> That's funny. You guys saying the Citizens Atlas did good in the cinema? to carry their ID card at all times. Report all signs of infection to your nearest area administrator. Remember, in action costs lives. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would definitely be better. Have they ever taken an escalator before? Whoa. <laughs> That's funny. But if you don't do anything, she actually like trips out of it. <laughs> That's really cool. I really like this DLC. It adds <gasps> some no fucking way. Absolute magical you. backstory to Ellie's personality. It's really cool. Oh, please tell me I can play on the arcade machine. <gasps> okay, we're gonna play a zombie game <laughs> in our oh, zombie no. game. Don't tell me it's busted. <laughs> it's busted. Damn it. Man, for a second I thought I was gonna play it. Me too! How? Right, come here. Close your eyes. Do it. Okay. Use this to move. This is your punch, this is your kick, and you block with this. Okay. First, you have to choose your character. Your Please let me play the game! Unstoppable. Claw wielding yet drop dead gorgeous angel knives. Am I supposed to picture all this? Eyes. Okay, sorry. She stands on the edge of the shadow temple. An ancient mystical. Please let me play this. This game sounds amazing. Your opponent, Damn it. Black Fang, steps out of the temple. He's this super ripped white dude with three arms. Three arms? He's what a four. For your blood. The music kicks up as he gets into his fighting stance. This is a, this is a, um, um, whatchamacallit, a flashback, Morangana, this is a flashback. Um, this, this DLC is while Joel is, uh, sick, and Ellie is running around trying to find medicine and food for him, and she's having these flashbacks to, like, before she met Joel. How the emotional damage of this game doing? Uh, not, not, not that much so far, Unicorn, but... I'm I'm sure it's right around the corner. Yes. You ready? Bring it. Round one. Fight. Round one starts. Black Fang rushes towards you. He throws a double punch in your direction. Jump up. There. He overshot you. You land behind him. Quickly, punch him in the back. Punch him in the back. You nailed him with a wicked elbow, taking off like 15% of his health. That's not 15%. Yes. He spins around and comes back with a shadow claw attack. What do I do? Hold back and block to counter. You throw up your elbows just as he executes his combo. Yeah. You skid backwards, but take no damage. The final block knocks him off his balance. He could recover any second. Quickly, counter with a heavenly lift. Down, a heavenly up, lift. Kick. Bam, bam, bam. Nice. He grabs you. Mash punch to break free. Hit Just up, bad at that. I mean, kick. there's not... There's not that much... Uh, you got it. Down, forward, punch for a special move. Yes, fuck him up. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. Yes. Oh. Right. Jesus Christ. Yeah, perfect game, bitches. Perfect. Your time here is done. There's, there's a, like, Marangoni can also play on uh, easier difficulties. The screen turns dark. 
Angel Knives' blades begin to bend. She pierces his torso again and again until his heart flies. Okay, they're playing Mortal Kombat. <laughs> she winds back her leg and roundhouses his head clean off. A geyser of blood covers the entire. Yeah, they're playing Mortal Kombat. Oh, nice. That oh, yeah, no, definitely Angry Midget. Angel Knives throws her fists in the air. You, you can play it on easier, Morangana, yeah, and uh, it's also very, like, so? the better you are at stealth, right. the easier the game gets, Loved basically. It. <laughs> yeah, I kind of did. <laughs> you hear that? Oh, no. Hey, you know what? We should head back. I need to head back. You got plenty of time. Oh, no. Riley, I don't have any more strikes left at this place. Tomorrow we'll just pick up where we left off. I can't. Oh, she's leaving. We'll, we'll just it's good to see you, Angry Midget. <laughs> okay, Firefly Girl, when? They've asked me to leave. Leave what? Boston. I'm supposed to join a group in another city. I argued with them to stay here. But you know how Marlene is. Nothing's easy with her. Everything's a test. They're picking me up tomorrow. Oh, God. Okay. That's it? Well, what do you want me to say? I don't know. How about some friendly advice? <laughs> I'm serious. Why did you bring me here? Oh my god. I oh, this is so sad. Oh. No, why did you bring me here? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Because. Oh, preteens. Guys, you, you have feelings you for advice? each other. Just go. Like, hug. Come on, let's just say our goodbyes. I'm gonna go check out this music. Riley. Don't do it. Riley! Damn it. Oh no. Where the hell did she go? Oh god, Riley. no! Riley! Oh, uh, please, no! Starting to figure out, you know, emotions. I'm suddenly concerned. <laughs> suddenly, concern. <laughs> suddenly, a hecking concern. Oh god. Well, this is very creepy. Do we have equipment? No. Okay. I guess we're not supposed to have any equipment while we're doing this thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I've always wanted to do that. Jesus. It's a lot of mannequin. I mean, it's a shopping mall, you know? <gasps> you ever seen anything like this? Are we just done talking? I don't know, are we? Oh no. You don't get to be pissed off at me. I'm pissed off at you. For what? Asking you what you think? When have you ever cared about what I oh, think? Oh no! We were good. We were better than good, and then you told me to fuck off, and then you just up and vanish. The man in Oh yeah, no, I completely this agree. Whole day. I was giving her side eye. Yeah. Giving her the look. Uh, you feel guilty? What am I, my good friend, anxiety? Out? Right? Uh, I'm, I'm giving it to you. I'm supposed to be holed up on the other side of town. I get caught as a firefly, I'm dead. Guilt didn't make me cross a city full of soldiers, Ellie. And yeah, I did some shit that I don't know how to take back, but I'm trying. <laughs> Speaking of, those water guns you've been dreaming of? I nearly got shot for these. Surprise.
I always thought Riley was Marlene for some reason. I mean, it would have made sense if it wasn't Ellie's flashback. First, I'm going to destroy you. And then we'll talk. But since it's, you know, Ellie's Good childhood friend, <laughs> can't be Marlene. You got Firefly you know? Girl. <laughs> oh, we're doing. Don't get too comfortable now. Okay. Ellie, come on. Oh, oh you're going to pay for oh, that. Damn it. Yeah. Ah. Oh, man. Ah. I'm coming for you, Ellie. Jesus Christ, she's fucking destroying us. What the hell? Like, do my hits count for anything here? Yeah, <laughs> there it is. Damn it! Oh, I... Okay, we oh, lost. Oh, <laughs> uh, hey, Ooh. Becky, it's good to I see you. Fucked you up. What? You barely even hit me. You're drenched. Okay. You count to five. I'll go hide, and we'll hunt each other. Whoever gets hit first loses. Fine. Oh no. Williams Moore, thank you so much for that follow. You are wonderful. Welcome to the whole more. I appreciate you. Four, five. Ooh. Yeah, Marangana, because you like you know it's gonna go terribly, right? That's the thing. Damn it! And one of my ears are. Oh shit! What? This came fucking running at me. That's, I mean, great, great Should tactic. But... Just go hide. <laughs> One, two, three, four. That's the thing, Marangona. You know. Time to die. You know shit's about to go terribly, horribly, irreversibly wrong because. You know, Ellie was talking about her friend. How? Fuck. Game! Oh, I'm literally... Man. Wow. Ah. You guys saw that I hit. You guys saw that I hit. Uh, whatever. Wow. Okay, you know what? You got lucky. Luck? Yeah. Ah. Wanna go again? I... The death battle was Dude. this? Uh, this, this is, uh... This is Super Soaker battle. Back. I gotta go back. Okay. Fine. Matrix Dodge has to be felt like it. Can I at least walk you home? Oh. Uh, I guess. I'm literally just waiting for. Let me get my backpack. The rug pull. Hey. So. Oh my god, the rug pull. It's coming. <laughs> I said it like an asshole, uh, but oh god! I totally meant it. You should go. I mean, this is something that you've wanted for, you know, forever. So, who am I to stop you? <laughs> the one person that can. No, please don't go. I'll be so miserable without you. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, I got my emotions. I'll be fine. And you'll be fine. And we'll see each other again. Oh, God, why? You should keep these. I know it's coming. Hey, The Last of Us 2 is ready. That's awesome. Oh, shit. You still like that Walkman around? Always. Let me see it. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> that tape you gave me? You really will be miserable without me. <laughs> Shut up. 
Leave that. Follow me. Oh god. <laughs> what are we doing? You'll see. Why would you cut onions right now, Becky? Oh no. Uh, Fuck! Uh, why? Uh, why? Your happy ending theory got taken away pretty fast, Morgan. <laughs> Uh. As for dancing on display glass, don't don't do that at home, kids. But these like these girls were 13, 14, so you know, good for them. They were having fun because they could. Young love has heartbreak, yeah, but like there's limits, nanners. You know, you got heartbreak, and then you got like just getting irreversibly nuked in the fields because it's a post-apocalyptic wasteland heartbreak. You know what I mean? Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. oh. Well, at least Ellie got a little nap. She got a little nap. That's good. Oh, so it's just Oh. Oh no. Oh no, that's the crew. That's the crew that crashed in here. Oh no. Oh, buddy. Oh. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> normal heartbreaks and then getting eaten alive by zombies heartbreaks oh my god Run! Shit. oh shit oh shit what the hell relax what the hell are we doing here Fuck about oh, it's these dudes again. Girl. Shit. The sooner we find them, the sooner we get out of here. So make sure this area is clear. I'll look around over here. Okay. Back. Where's the guy that went over? This way. Okay. What about the guy that went? I thought it was three people. Okay. Whatever. What? What? Whatever. Okay, Ellie about to go, uh... Ellie about to go on a rampage. Oop. There's the third guy. Okay. Shit. Oh! Okay, well, that's game over. <laughs> Maybe it's not. Maybe it isn't game over. Still got that health pack. Where's the last dude? Oh, wow, okay. Well, you're stupid. There we go. Little bit too liberal with the ammo there, but I'm coming to get you, Joel. These guys want to fight. Oh. You also have to fight other humans because why would you all work together? Right? Him. Stitch him up, and then I'm gonna get the hell out. Well, I mean, Marangona, we found out later that you know these guys are uh, these these guys, these dudes, these uh, people that we're currently fighting. Uh, they're from like a cannibal society. Uh, so, yeah. That's fun for everybody involved. <laughs> oh boy, yeah. And, and their leader was like slightly pedo. He was like, he was like 
be going all like you're special to ellie and stuff it was very uncomfortable uh was never confirmed but heavily implied and yeah uh so yeah Th these guys these guys broke bad <laughs> had to start some laundry trago that's uh that's that's wonderful sunday is laundry day at our house as well a man's gotta eat yeah but a man's not gonna eat a man's nordic like you get you get a like degenerative you can get a degenerative brain disease from eating people meat don't eat people guys it's uh like it has long-term health issues don't invite a cannibal to the dinner table precisely it's like as, when you start eating people that there's no coming back from that you know what i mean like you start eating people that's it you know no other human being is gonna trust you and you can't really trust yourself around other humans can you oh god no <laughs> can we end the gun here don't eat people don't eat people shouldn't have to say it can we just get out here no i picked okay. apparently, not. apparently that's not allowed <sighs> which way not that way but who are you little buddy Man. well that's another one of the dudes he lost his leg and a hand wonder what i says like um According to people who have uh, interviewed cannibals, the cannibals say that people taste like pork. But like very skinny pork without much flavor. Starvation also is healthy. <laughs> yes, Angry Midget. But like, don't create a society out of cannibalism. You know what I mean? Tattoos taste bad, Becky? Oh, hell yeah. I'm going to get tattoos all over when the apocalypse hits. surviving member of my crew and I'm gonna die in an air duct <laughs> Reagan what did you expect me to do I was bitten and it was only a matter of time before she killed me even though I wasn't infected what she said she wasn't going to but I could see through her why else would she reach for her gun? Why the fuck did she reach for her gun? I was just talking to her. If she wasn't lying, I wouldn't have to hit... She would have shot me. I'm sure of it. Okay. Then why'd she keep you... Dumber said that? Yeah, yeah. Oh no. I'm bleeding to death and I can't sew it back up. Well, not with one arm. I can't make the fucking knot. Regan. So cold. Holy shit. I'm happy you're not. I'm happy you're not making that joke, Septic. This is actually fucked up. Welcome to this game, Nordic! Everything considered, this was pretty light! This was pretty light, Nordic! This wasn't even close! To... Some of the shit we've seen! Anyone checking here? Oh, fuck these guys. Going through this game. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Use the zombies as weapons! Yeah, kill each other, assholes. Dude loves the zombies. Oh, yeah. 
Listen, zombies don't have guns. It's very simple. Zombies stupid, people smart. Save, uh... Save some ammo. Just... Oh. Don't... Buddy. Whoa! Here we go! I should have just I should have just retreated up here, shouldn't I? Well, um I think I need to restart this encounter. <laughs> oh my god, the mister is really heavy. That's okay though. Got a little bit of side lore for it to find. It's also super heavy, right? Thank God. There you are. What'd you find? Shh, the place is swimming. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so the guy just straight up ran up here. So I guess we just gotta be ready for that. That's one dude down. Don't don't climb up here, sir. Don't don't do it. This 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 is our spot. This is my spot. I'm not getting my spot. And I'm telling you. Oh, you got one. Is it safe to drop down here? Honestly, I had no idea if that would work. They're finished. Well, let's find that old man. I was not sure that would work. I was like, well, if I throw a breath. Really? You're gonna pay for that. Oh, am I? Well, it's over, dipshit. I got the high. Oh, for fuck's sake. Go. Ah, high ground. But yeah, I just thought it would be fun if it worked, and turns out it works. I'm surprised there's not more opportunities for that in this game. Really. Hello there. <laughs> Just obi wan him. I did, Nordic. But I am kind of confused because... How did he see me? You know? Apparently, like, they got really good... They're really good at seeing you. Like, from here, and he was walking like this, and then he saw me up there somehow. Well, they don't have peripheral vision, but apparently if I'm anywhere in front of them, they can just see me. So that's fun. He looked up. Yeah, but like... They didn't look up before. <laughs> you know what I mean? I mean, we got a shit ton of arrows, though. Look at this, man. Noise. They're cannibals. They can smell you. I'll take that explanation. I'll take that explanation, actually. Okay, who's here played both? Who here has played both games? Both Last of Us 1 and Last of Us 2. He's taller as well. That's... <laughs> That's actually a good point as well. Oh man, oh man. Guys, the last few weeks... I've done really well in terms of like, slimming down a little bit. But I gotta say... It sucks! To do like a... To do like a steady process of weight loss because you're so tired all the time you're so lethargic and you're just so fed up with everything so yesterday we made proper pasta carbonara and it was everything i hoped for it was so good i ate way too much we did it with the proper ham the proper cheese fucking 
the fanciest eggs we could find it was great would you want to know just just who just who's played it honestly that's all i want to know i just want to know who's been there who's done that and who's excited for the next one are they patrolling or are they just you know higging and the hugging Sounds amazing, dude. What was that? It was the best. Hey, you get fight outside? Oh shit! How do we know they're even here? We walked around this entire place. There's horse tracks leading in. They're coming out. No. They're here. Well, maybe they're already dead. I don't want to see their fucking bodies. Right. <laughs> it's gotta be fucking her. We killed each other. We got an infected. There we go. Have fun. Have fun, boys. <laughs> oh my god. I love this. I I love the fact that No, no, no. Don't come here. Don't come here. Don't come here. Yeah. Good. Oh, that's so scary, man. That's so freaking scary. Exact, exactly, Nordic. Exactly. Because they're mushrooms, it's just like... They, they just keep... As it were. So I would say... So I would say these are more dangerous than uh, Walking Dead. Oh god. They're more dangerous than Walking Dead uh, zombies. <laughs> so there I was looking for loot. No. I mean, I think this is pretty great. They are more dangerous, yeah. Oh wow. The uh <clears throat> the infected actually won that round. Entertainment at its best. Yeah. <laughs> are they <gasps> are they just going back to their rooms? Because that's pretty great. If they are. Oh shit. Maybe they're not. You gotta, you gotta cure the infection, guys. So, we're curing, we're curing it, we're curing the world of, for cannibals, and we're curing the world for infected, you know? Imagine if you had to sneeze right then. Fun fact, you don't sneeze when your adrenaline is up. Funnily enough. Like, it's, it's just a thing, like... You don't you don't sneeze when you're in a life or death situation. It's like your nose is like, you know what? I don't care if what is in our nose is not ideal for us right now. Because there's something that's gonna eat us. Really? There's something that's going to eat us that is way more dangerous than whatever might not be comfortable in our noses at the moment. And then you just don't sneeze. Right, what we got? Uh, we already have... No, we don't have health kit. We use the health kit. There we go. Going through these health kits like they're freaking candy bars! Not happy about that. Oh, shit. All right. 
The eye burns on the bridge, President 99, uh, 99% of the time is it'll stop the sneeze. Eyebrows and the bridge of your nose. Like, like here? To stop you from sneezing? That's pretty cool. I like that the game actually takes its time to, like, switch weapons. It makes it so that you actually have to plan out your weapon switches a little bit better. It's a very cool... Very cool thing. Very good design choice. From their part. Oh my god, that's a lot of arrows. Is there a limit to how many arrows we can have? Or? There. That's it. Dude, sending out these runners, these clickers, these infected things to deal with marauders. That is just flipping genius, man. It was, uh, wasn't it Bill? Bill used that. Bill had a, like, perimeter that he purposefully filled with clickers or infected in order to, like, keep people away from his shit. I think that was really cool. Like, that's, that's someone who's in it for, like, the long, like, he, he's in it to survive for a, the longest time possible. You know what I mean? Work smarter, not harder. Exactly. I mean, that makes sense, though. It's like, it's like having a castle, and then you have a moat, but instead of like you know spikes and alligators you have infected <laughs> which means that the defensive moat can become an offensive moat and i think that is really a really fun thought <laughs> all right let's get the hell out of here Also, seriously, any freaking chance at letting these cannibal dudes just get, you know, basically, basically give them a taste of their own medicine. They want to eat people. Well, you know, then we need to do an empathy exercise and see what happens when we let them be eaten. You know, when the eaters become the ETs. Okay, we're back here. Nice. Well, then we just walk over here. And we're almost back. No way, game. You're not doing this to me. You're not giving me this loot. Hey, I hear the fucking horse behind you. Help me get the soul. Yeah, yeah, we'll get the door. You guys keep searching. I don't want to get ambushed. Well, that's GG. Right, so Ellie can't Ellie can't kill people stealthily without without bow and arrow. So that's fun. It's a fun little fact right there. Wait, how did you see me? All right, I'm gonna leg last the shit out of all of you. Hope you're okay with it. <laughs> I saw Lord of the Rings, bitches. Oh, fuck. <laughs> there you are. 
you go, Ellie. That's how you do it. Hold up. Wait, where's my... There you go. Right in the mouth. Oh, shit. Hey, she's over here. No, I'm not. is a dawn. Shit, the girl's out here. Correct. <laughs> She's got that stiletto knife, you know. You gotta fear the stiletto knife. Why are they not? Hey, you gotta do something. What about the old man? <laughs> oh, <shit>. <laughs> That's right. The mall is speaking teenager. Asshole. Nothing more terrifying than a mall that speaks teenager. There we go. Roll around. Really? I don't know. Keep an eye out. Who are you talking to, sir? There we go. Shot you in the ass. Oh wow. <laughs> oh, did some yoga, did we? Jesus. Oh my god. Well, I wonder how the cinematic is going to play out. All right, Joel. Let's go. <laughs> oh. Down there by the door. Fuck, Got to fuck. pin down. Go finish her. Fuck you. Fine. You want to do this? Fuck you. <laughs> Hear that? Over that way. What? Oh shit. Oh shit! Oh shit! Man, okay, this this part is hard. This part is difficult. This part is very difficult, as a matter of fact. Really? Game. I'm gonna pay for what? Oh, come on, dude! Oh, this game. Serpentine! Serpentine! Okay, we get Do you know? Fucking pay for this kid! Sure thing, you first! Right. Where you assholes at? Uh, 
Okay. Next! God damn it. Okay, so the knife just doesn't... They, they don't care about the knife. That's, that's good to know. Got it. I feel like I overestimate the power of knife. If that makes sense. No loser. Infected have come a bit sooner. God damn. Jesus. All right. We're out of health packs. We're out of everything, basically. But on the plus side. Oh my god. We need we need more we need more alcohol. We need more medical alcohol. Oh god, okay. Well, while they're all out having fun, we need to look for healing. Jesus Christ. This segment, man, it goes hard. It goes extremely hard. As a matter of fact, oh yes. Please. A lot of rags. Not a lot of alcohol. Okay, we're just gonna... Just gonna stay hidden. Until they've all dealt with each other. You know? Yeah. Yeah, that's right. You just curse and yell and... Make a lot of noise. Um, I'm completely okay with this. Question, the cordyceps. Like, the infected. Do they go after... Uh, animals? You know? Like, if, if the infected sees... Uh, If the infected see a uh, horse, you know, are they gonna run after that horse? What are we, what are we dealing with here? Is that the only infected left? Oh god! Oh god! Oh shit! That was the wrong thing to do. The wrong button, damn it! Oh. Hello, gentlemen and toys! Welcome to the stream. Oh! Okay, that's that's a better start than last time, I feel. Especially if I can get the drop on them in some way. Hmm. Oh my god, how, how am I? This, this, is the, this is the most difficult segment so far in this game. Dominator, I'm uh... It's very difficult right now. To deal with. Because there's both infected and people. And uh... You're kind of bad at hunting each other. You know what I mean? That didn't make them go there. Oh, those are the... There's the clickety-clackers.
It was gonna try and, you know, create a symphony of sound for them to follow. Did you have a great weekend? I had a fantastic weekend, Dominantor. How was yours? Man, what I would have given for a nail bomb or something right about now. The Funk Soul Brother. What about you, Dominator? How's your weekend? I mean, I got the high ground. So I'm not too worried. I'm, I'm mo moisturized. Unbothered. Didn't you assholes hear it? My weekend's been needed big time, dude. Same. I was... I was absolutely floored yesterday. I was crushed to bits. Reduced to atoms. Yeah, shoot, shoot your gun, man. See what happens. Shoot your gun, asshole. Well, this is terrifying. weekend has been so good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we, we went to a friend of mine's birthday party at, like, this super awesome uh, Chinese restaurant. It was fantastic. One mighty beautiful ring you got, lady. Thank you. Listen, it, it has to look like it was forged by dwarves. You know what I mean? Gotta. Gotta make it look like it was forged by dwarves. Otherwise, you know, what you what you doing? What you doing with yourself? Okay, where's, where's the guy? There's the guy. I seen him. Big hug, Dominator. Thank you for the big hug. I am currently... Got a little bit occupado, but soon enough there will be huggings. Like, what if I just, like... Where are they all? <laughs> okay, Dominant. Thank you for the big hug. I also trimmed down my mustache. Just because it's finally uniform in length, so now it's going to be nice and easy to take care of. And, uh, yeah. That's, uh, that's, that's all that happened this weekend, actually. Cooked a whole bunch of uh, tasty spaghetti carbonara because I was in dire need of calories. <laughs> oh, damn. Okay, we... Oh. The infected isn't close enough. Then again, I mean... Hey, buddy. Bye, buddy. Oh, now I get the rifle. I see. All right. Oh, shit. Good. That's it. Okay. If anyone's alive, don't even think about surprising me. You let up like your friends, you hear me? God damn. That was a good shot, yeah. though. Straight through his freaking face maker plate. Yeah. And your hair has been cut? Yes, yes, I did also cut my hair, Dominator. Thank you for noticing. Oh my god, this game! Oh, it's so intense! You better be alive, Joel. Woo! Didn't they have just gone in from the outside? Oh. Oh shit, okay. This way. 
Okay, Ellie. we're now dealing with the flashbacks again. What about our backpacks? Uh, fuck the backpacks. Yeah, fuck the backpacks. Shit. Oh god. Climb! Here. Help me out. Climb, people. All right, lift. And Find go. Prop it up with. I'll hold it. Hurry! There it is. There it is. Go, 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 go. Oh my! Almost through. Yeah, I'm working on it. Just the game is not very nice. Why not move the thing? Okay. Good thing she has a gun, right? <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, God. No! Okay. Oh, shit. I thought, I thought that was her. I, uh, I saw... I need to, I need to pay more attention. Oh, shit. Rule number one, cardio, people. I'm right behind you. Right behind you. Keep running. That's not running. Go for it. Good thing you got that stiletto, girl. Keep running. All right. Up the stairs. The scaffolding. That's our way out. Ooh, shit. Uh-oh. It's back in. Oh, they're behind us, too. This way. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Oh, God. Out, out, out. Ellie! I'm good, I'm good. Keep going. Oh, Jesus. There's an open window. Oh, my God. Thank you, Rocket. Thank you so much for that follow. You are indeed wonderful. And welcome to the host border. Come on! Thank you, game. I got you. Hold on, give me your hand. No! No shot, you haven't gotten spoiled or something, right? So the secret is playing a shit ton of Super Didn't Get Game Release 2013. Yeah, and I played League of Legends and World of Warcraft then. Didn't really play single player RPGs. The trick is to never... I'm great, Clanky Rocket, thank you so much. That, like... Why would I care about games I don't play, right? So, you know what I mean? And uh, then I get to... Uh... I'll make sure to spoil it for you. Hey mods, do you wanna you wanna ban someone? You wanna pay attention to stream for to chat for me and ban someone for me? Thank you. Joke again. <laughs> We've actually had people come in and be like that, right? So like literally asking that, like, number one, how are you not spoiled yet? And then I'm like, this is how I'm not spoiled. I played, you know, competitive super tunnel vision games for a really long time. And then they're like, well, <laughs> luckily my mods are on it. My mods are on it and they, um, they ban people. So it's great. <laughs> luckily we were fast with saying joke. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's also true. Uh, what's happened to my arms, Dominator? What do you mean? Also, Clanky Rocket, I'm I'm freaking phenomenal. Thank you so much for asking. How are you? How's your weekend been? Uh so yeah. It's been um uh, it's been it's been a ride, Reich Show, and uh, we're gonna start The Last of Us 2 after this. I think it's clear. They both got bit, right? Ellie. Ellie, your arm. Ah, shit. Sad, annoyed, and tired? What? Did you... Have you been playing The Last of Us? No, no, no. <laughs> because that's how I feel after playing this game. Oh, no! They both got... No! 
Oh my god, and they 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 were just they kissed each other and she was gonna stay with Elliot. Oh no! I'm not Don't okay, worry. man. I know I'm she sorry. told the story about this, but seeing it happened, I'm not okay. Oh. What's a gel blaster, Clanky Rocket? Just stay calm. Yes. Okay, so she's gonna do surgery on Ellie. No, on Joel. That's good. It's bit in the ride, eh? How dare you, Strictly? Oh boy. There's some more stuff over there. You can you, oh, okay, so it's an airsoft thing. I'm sorry, your airsoft gear broke, Clanky. That's a bummer and a half. It's always a bummer when, you know, hobby things start breaking. Where I see it, we got two options. Option one. Glock to the face. We take the easy way out. It's quick and painless. I'm not a fan of option one. Two? What? Fight. Oh no, that's from my that's from my thing, Dominator. Shoots Orbeez. Ah. Yeah, I'm Norwegian, right? So. <clears throat> and uh, Dominator was written, writing Danish. It's basically the same language when written. Gel blaster sounds like it could be a penis joke. That's true. You're Swedish, right, so? Sertabru, Sertabru. We should have died before today. Now, excuse me, I'm gonna get my heart broken. For tomorrow. But we fight for every second we get to spend with each other. Whether it's two minutes or two days, we don't give that up. Oh, this is how she learned how to, yeah. Up. My vote? Let's just wait it out. You know, we can be all poetic and just lose our minds together. Oh! What's option three? Sorry. And Ellie's gonna be immune and let's get out of here. Oh, <laughs> oh god. You bought it yesterday? Oh clanky, I'm sorry, man. Yeah, we just finished the we just finished the DLC, right? So Oh my god! <laughs> We finished the main game uh, on Thursday. Oh shit! How dare you, game? How how very dare you? Jesus Christ! That's not okay, man. <laughs> shit! Right. Where's my Where's my Last of Us Two? <laughs> the game is so good, but it hurts so much. It hurts so freaking much, man. What happened? Uh, Maringana, Ellie kissed, uh, what's her name? I don't remember her name because that's how I deal, that's how I deal with these things in this game. People I know are gonna die, I don't, I try to forget their names. Anyways, she convinced her not to go, they kissed, she took off, like, the friend took off, now girlfriend took off her, like, firefly necklace, she wasn't gonna go, she wasn't gonna leave Ellie, and then suddenly zombies, like, the fucking clickers came, and they were running, and then they both got bit, and then we know what happened, because Ellie, you know, is immune, but her friend wasn't, so she, oh, my heart. Oh, told you you should play it before winter ground control. I'm I'm okay with I'm okay with having these fields now, actually. That was nice and that it all said. Right, come more. Riley, that's the one. Oh, Tuna, it's good to see you. Can we get a shout out for Tuna for lunch, please? Rising on a wrecking ball. Hello, Tremendo Beats. 
Woo, okay, we're gonna we're gonna update the uh, we're gonna update the stream info to be uh, unspoiled. Oh, I actually don't have to update. I just have to update which part I'm playing. That's great. Okay, let's see. No spoilers. We're gonna have, we're gonna have two spoilers tag here. Two spoiler tags. Uh, no backseating hard mode first playthrough unspoiled playthrough. Yeah, okay. You know what? That's fair. That's that's the one we're gonna go with. It's great. We're now playing on on Twitch at least. We're now playing Last of Us Part Two. Oh my God, Septic. Uh, would you mind uh, tagging everyone in the Discord and tell them that we're now playing The Last of Us Two, and uh, just just so everybody knows what's happening. We're starting The Last of Us Two. There we go, and uh, then I'm getting it out on Twitter because, you know, it's just it's just standard marketing, isn't it? Oh my god, yes. So, if you're new here, uh, the the VOD of beating the game is, uh, or beating the, uh, beating the main game is uh, out on YouTube and on Twitch, obviously. My thoughts on what the game, like, what the first uh, Last of Us game is actually about is on... Um, my gaming my youtube gaming channel and uh yeah so if you if you feel like you want to see that exclamation point youtube gaming in the uh in the chat and then uh then you should be able to uh, then then you can see it as much as you want to i'm gonna pee there's a little bit of music i'm gonna pee uh and refill my water and uh then we can then we can go back in on it it's more spoilable and the only thing I don't like is the chronological order they use. I don't think it's fair for some characters. Ground control. Okay. Okay. Well, um, I, I appreciate that ground control. I think then I will hold off. I will hold off on what I think about The Last of Us 2. Uh, I guess until we're done. Would that be a fair way of going through the game ground control? Since you've obviously played it. To just hold off <laughs> until I have until I have the whole story. Let's see. I need to pee and get my water though, so I will be right back. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Who is ready? Who is ready for some freaking Last of Us 2? I, I honestly have no idea if I'm ready. Also, Tuna, are you still here, buddy? Because if you are, I just need to say that you are absolutely incredible and amazing. And uh, I love you. And uh, now... Right. Okay, let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. All right. Ah! Oh, 
that is. I I already <laughs> I'm already afraid. I'm emotionally not ready. Let's go, dude. Same. <laughs> Same Gamora. I already dislike the image they had there. Okay. We're gonna do this properly. We're gonna we're gonna we're not gonna we're gonna crash the 4K capture utility, give that a nice little reboot. You ready for more emotional damage? Emotional damage. God, I love I love that meme. I love that meme. Catch up game. Come on. Good. All right. Text to speech. Text to speech Te off. Enables narration of on-screen text. No way. They Left actually. And right directional buttons change. Oh, that is awesome. That is awesome, actually. That's pretty cool. Until they fit into the corners of your screen. Okay, there we are. Brightness always slightly higher on the brightness for the streamies. Because it's darker on stream for whatever reason. And continue. Is in part one remake as well. Oh yeah, true, true. True. Yeah, when I set it up the first time, I remember. Only have another Irish time to watch. Listen, the VODs will be there. Uh -huh. Subtitles. Uh, story and combat dialogue. Yes, please. Medium background. That's okay. And names is okay. Color. Don't need color. Good. Audio. Where's my... Okay. Well, I don't have a surround. Okay, I need to. I have stereo headphones. Exactly. Uh, center channel, dynamic range. Mono audio. Okay, there we go. Can I turn it up somehow? Vishnix is built. That is so cool that they did this. It's also not the same. That is true, Gamora. And thank you for, thank you for being so kind. <laughs> oh. That's great access, great accessibility options. Amazing accessibility options. <sighs> I'm afraid. Because The Last of Us won. Hit pretty damn hard, you know what I mean? Okay, so everything's maxed. Okay, that's all right. Okay, story. New game. Playing on hard. Playing on hard because... No, wait. Uh, we played on Survivor last time. Yeah, we played on Survivor. <laughs> this difficult is not recommended for a first playthrough. <laughs> Excuse you, game! I am a gamer. And if I play the first game on Survivor, I'm gonna play the second game on Survivor. Bitches. Me also give me, give me story mode. <laughs> See you later, Marangana. Developing Chrono for people with this. Oh, that's awesome, Strictly. Oh, okay, people with vision. Uh, yeah. With the, uh, oh, what's it called? I literally had an exam on this. Literally took a certification in what is the most respectable way to talk about blind people uh yeah it's okay flowers welcome to the stream my name is subtacris but joel is in this game oh papa winchester <laughs> Is that a moth or a firefly? 
I don't know what happened. I'm supposed to take her to the fireflies and walk away. Oh, okay. We're getting uh, we're getting an immediate like update. If you go halfway across the country with someone, she needed her immunity to mean something. Maybe I was starting to buy into that old cure business. Moth, okay. Maybe I just wanted to do right by her. And then we made it. We found the firefly. Because of her, they were actually going to make a cure. They thought! We don't know. We still don't know. The only catch. They would kill her. What are you doing? I won't let you take her. This is our future. Think of all the lives we'll save. Jesus Christ, Joe. Like, we still don't know if that actually would do. have... Like, come on! I saved her. Because, like, let's be real here. Come on, baby girl. They had no proof that they would be able to... I've already rant... I have already ranted about it. But we have no proof that there would be anything at all that would allow them to make a cure just because Ellie was immune. And... There is no cure for a fungal infection. That too! It has to be Ellie's choice. Well, the fireflies didn't ask her, did they? Did they, Strictly? Listen, I'm mad at everybody involved here, except Ellie. Alright? I'm mad at that doctor for being like, oh, 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 We're just gonna <laughs> her entire brains. And that's gonna give us a cure. No! They just uh gotcha. gotcha. The science is not quite there. Cover the exit. Don't let him get away. God damn. It's like yeah, no, That's like, so. they just say that they would have had a cure, but... That's a lot. <laughs> what does Ellie know? This is art. It's insane, too. Now, have you played this game before? Tests. I told her. Woo! And she believed you? Nah. I didn't say otherwise. Nah, she doesn't believe him. We should head back. I still maintain, though, that, uh, you know... Very dry, arid countries would do extremely well under these conditions. Because, you know, fungus needs humidity. <laughs> you know what I mean? Also, Arctic environments would do very well. Because you would literally just be able to walk around with a hammer in winter and... Knock infected in the face. <laughs> Use PS3 back in the day to check it out. Oh, hell yeah. 
They were willing to kill a child, and if they had a cure, how would they distribute it? Listen, the, the distribution would have been the least of the problems, Master Puppy, but... It, it is the fact that they had... They just said that, like, we have found something that is immune, so we're gonna take that thing that is immune, and we're gonna recreate it. And I was like, that's not how science works. Um, it's like, everybody, everybody involved were fucking stupid, okay? Just live underwater. <laughs> And then you get one spore in the air system. Ground control. But look at that! They have a city and everything! You know? It's like... You would eventually be able to rebuild... ...humanity. Especially given that there are still doctors and engineers teaching their skills to the next generation, you know? Like, focus on that instead of focusing on a cure, you know what I mean? The Fireflies are a terrorist organization to everyone, no one trusted to handle a cure. That, that also true, Master Puppy. Suddenly, the Fireflies would be, you know... A freaking imperial power, you know what I mean? Flowers, thank you so much for that follow. You are wonderful and welcome to the wholesome order. There's no good or evil in this universe, just tragedy. That's also true. Terrorist? I mean, they did blow up a bunch of, like, stuff. I don't know. Listen, one person's, one person's freedom fighter is another person's terrorist, okay? Nobody's wrong. It was a cure. It lasts about 15 minutes until people way too greedy would fight for it and destroy everything. Yes! And hold it hostage to, you know, keep their hold on power. Especially, especially in this uh, post-apocalyptic society. Crone, enjoy the lurk! Calling anyone bad and good in this universe just plain wrong. Yeah, it's all, sh it's all different shades of doing what needs to be done. You know what I mean? Firefly is just the Naughty Dog version of the NCR. <laughs> What's the NCR? Oh yeah, the new California Republic. Yeah, 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 of course. Dog eat dog world. Oh yeah. Dude, but look at this though! They got this whole thing! You know? They can also just dig a moat. Why don't they have a moat? They should have a moat. Seriously, what's what's wrong with ditches, guys? Why why don't you build you need ditches? A person is fine and people, that's when it gets messy. Yeah, but it's like okay. we we've been over this, right? Yeah. Every natural disaster that has happened ever. Even in modern times, people band together and help each other out, you know? The, like, media wants you to believe that, you know, there's, like, roving bands of terrible people that are going to do everything to take everything they can from everyone, right? Here's the thing. Those groups, while dangerous, do not survive long term. The people that band together and help each other out and take in survivors so that they can help them out, survive. That's how human society has functioned ever since we started collecting in tribes. Gathering in tribes, not collecting. Gathering in tribes. Which is always, like, it's always why I get a little bit like, yeah, it's whatever, when, you know, they create these narratives in post-apocalyptic games. You sure? <laughs> Never played two? Dude, it's... It looks just as good as uh, the uh, re the graphically reimagined part one, now, which I guess is... I can't say I'd have done different. Yeah. Good lad, Tommy. Good lad. I'll take to the grave if I have to. Good boy, Tommy! Tommy knows what's up! Good morning, Kal El. I'll see you later, Tom. Do better as part of the group. Yeah, everybody would do better as part of the group.
Someone that's not in your community gets ended or told to leave. Uh, no, prolific the guy, Jim. That's not how it works at all. Uh, you like if if people come to a tribe uh, and they can contribute, they're in on a trial thing. You know, not trusted but taken in, and like because everyone who can help should help, and eventually they gain the trust and they become included as part of the tribe. That's how it works. You don't survive by walling yourself up and not letting anybody in, you know? That's, uh, that's a recipe for disaster! You know? You're looking fresh, my guy. Thank you, Tuna. I, I got my hair cut and I uh, dealt with my beard and moustache this weekend. I feel good. A few years and people lived up on the hill and were defected came down to help with sandbags and stuff. Exactly, Gamora. It's always like that. He plays guitar. Uh, yeah, he, he said at some point during Last of Us 1 that he would, uh, that he would teach Ellie how to play, uh, how to play guitar. But basically, isolationism never works. Is what I'm trying to say. Um, the Last of Us Part 1. Um, the Last of Us Part 1 remastered version. I don't think it's on PC. Uh, but uh, it's on it, it it's on PlayStation 5 and it's coming to PC. What was it? In April or something? I think it comes in April. I don't know those lyrics strictly. Oh, she has posters from the comics she reads. That's cool. 28th. Okay, there you go. This is the song Ellie's listening to. Okay. Oh, Jesus. This gave me a heart attack. I tried knocking, but... Hey. Hey. What's up, Joel? Yeah, nah, she doesn't believe him. Just checking in. Folks are you know, talking about how impressed they are with you and how well you're helping out. Also, it's probably because, you know, they feel awkward around each other because they've been absolutely murdering their way through the U.S. Oh, and now they're in, like, a nice city. He, uh... <laughs> he told me a joke, and I, I thought about you. It's, um... Oh, shoot, no, I forgot it. Uh, something about a clock. Oh, this is painful. How do you... Joel, it's, uh... It's pretty late, and I gotta... Get up in a few hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I know. I'm, I'm gonna get out of your hair. I just, um, I, I want to show you something. Just give me one second. Yeah, exactly, Paprika. But like, honestly, I, I think it's because Ellie doesn't believe him. Like, there's a little What's part this? of him, part of her that doesn't believe him. Julie's really so awkward. Folks, Very much. Folks thing here, a guitar. A guitar. Funny. You want to hear something? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Promise me that you won't laugh. Oh, he put on a capo and everything. <laughs> He's ready. I'm trusting you. Deep breath. Oh, shit. Use L to choose a chord. Okay. <laughs> That was a very interesting... I actually had to use this thing if to strum. I ever were to lose you. 
That was pretty cool. I surely lose myself. Everything I have found here, I've not found by myself. Try and sometimes you'll succeed to make this man of me. All my stolen missing parts, I have no need for anymore. Well, this is a nice song. Yes, I believe. And I believe, because I can see our future days. Days of you. How far are you into this game, Rio? Uh, this is literally the prologue. Literally the prologue. We started it 10 minutes ago. Whew. Yeah, that's that's the perfect crying emote for that one, Strictly. Jesus. That didn't suck. <laughs> oh. I don't take what I can get. I shall bite my tongue. I appreciate you. She's yours. No. No, 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 no. I don't know the first thing I about this. I promise that I teach you how to play. Oh, man. Joel sounds so tired. He did. So what do you say? Tomorrow night? First lesson? Deal. Okay. Oh. Oh, Joel. Did... Do you remember the joke? Oh! Um... <laughs> what is the downside to eating a clock? It's time consuming! <sighs> it's time consuming. Hello, Ab. I knew it. That's so dumb. <laughs> yeah. You gonna steal that joke? It's great. Why did the watchmaker throw his watch out the window, Ab? Because he wanted to see time fly. Yes, exactly, Ab. Oh, that is ominous! Oh, that is ominous as hell! For you! We're just skipping one! Shit. What? <laughs> We're just skipping what? Hey. Morning. Sorry, I totally overslept. Just give me a minute and I'll get dressed. I heard you had quite a night after I left. I... She kissed me. It was just Dina being Dina. She didn't mean anything by it. I was talking about your fight with Seth. Wait. You kissed Dina? What? <laughs> it's happening! Oh. I thought this... We're broken up one week and you make a move on my girl? No. Probably just trying to make you jealous. I didn't. I would never. Oh, fuck, this is awkward. I'm messing with you, man. I don't care. Get dressed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jesus Christ. This is the first play I do. Yes. <sighs> Unspoiled. Get your stuff together while we're late. Hmm. Smells fine. <laughs> Tired. That's all right. Oh, 
Okay, so yeah, it's the same room. It's the same. She got the she got the thing. Wait, hold the fuck. Is that Joel's jacket? <sighs> sure. Looks like Joel's jacket. Well, I mean, it could be any jacket. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Hello, Anelticin. Uh, you want Ellie's hair? It's pretty cute. It's pretty cute. Yeah, no, I, I can watch the show now. Finally. Hey, is Joel up? Okay, Joel. It's not Joel's jacket, though, I suppose. That sucks. Shut up. <laughs> just about to get up. <laughs> All right. I was. You got everything? <sighs> yes. Okay. They got gloves and shit now? That's amazing. That's great. Heads up. You're the talk of the town this morning. <sighs> what? Let me see if I got this right. You kiss Dina. She kissed me. Which triggered Seth to call you a not so nice word. Yep. Then Joel decked him. Oh god. Have a push. And then you got mad at Joel. That part confused me. It was a strange night, man. Oh no. People were drunk. Sounds exciting. Look at that, they got greenhouses and shit. Maria wants a word with you. Where is she? Staying up in the The diner. Is this about Seth? No clue. Just tell her you never saw me. Nope. Where's your fucking loyalty? <laughs> Excuse me? Man, look at this. They have got like a semi-functional, semi-modern society okay, running here. So That's great. Who jogs and talks like that? Okay. Thanks. People are in good shape, Tuna. AKA not you and me, bro. <laughs> the trick is to have, you know, cardio, Tuna. The sec the secret ingredients is cardio. Yeah, of course. Dina and I are done. I know. It's just I don't want you to think. Ellie. <sighs> We're cool. Yeah, we gamers exactly. I lift weights. I don't run. Thanks. I'm gonna look. They have a logging industry. That's great. God damn that that is awesome. I mean, it probably what the hell happened to those kids. It probably makes sense to be far up north because of the thing that I mentioned where, you know, uh, infected, most likely not being able to move in winter, right? Because they don't produce their own heat. Wait, baby! Oh, yeah. I get tired and out of breath from walking these motherfuckers fit. I mean, you gotta when you have to run away from... Uh... Oh, shit. Nice. Oh, hi. Horses or bulls? I'm pretty sure these are horses. Oh no, it's venison! Here she comes. Shh. Yeah, 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 okay. That's why I had a hard time recognizing it. Okay, there's a lot of hunt a lot of hunting going on. You can pet the dog. Where's the fucking dog? I wouldn't go anywhere without saying howdy. Hey, what time is it? You put it in Yes! 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Best game of the series. We're definitely far away from David's camp. Oh yeah, for sure. It's either that or die. Yeah, that's true, Gamora. Here's the thing, though. Um, in, the, in a zombie apocalypse, you don't have to be the fastest or the one who runs the longest. You just have to never be the slowest or the ones who can run for the shortest. As long as you're second to last, you'll be fine. The trick is to stay away from the zombies though, too, no? You don't wanna you don't wanna risk it, you know what I mean? Just that run at least one, exactly. That's all you need to do. Run faster or long or somewhere. longer. No. Then at least yeah. one guy. In the back. Oh my god, look at that. 
excuse me. Ellie, there you are. Come here. That's uh, Tommy's wife, right? Seth's got something he wants to say to you. I don't want to hear what that bigot has to say. Do it for me, please. <sighs> Fine. Seth. Seth, come here. Oh my god. Hey. Uh, look, last night I was uh, I was drinking too much. He's apologizing. Sure. I'm trying to say I'm sorry. Oh, that's nice. Maria tells me that you and Dean are headed out. I uh, made you some sandwiches. Apology sandwiches. Apology accepted, man. Okay. Apology accepted. Your steak. Thank you, Seth. Yeah. Well, uh, you be safe out there. Yep. I appreciate that. What you got there? Bacon sandwiches. Mm. Smells good. I mean, they're still sandwiches. sandwiches. You sure? It's fine. What exactly did you do again? Apparently called uh, apparently called Ellie a gay slur or something to him. So I understand why Ellie is mad. You know, I understand why Ellie is mad. At the same time, free steak sandwiches. You know, I think I think that should make it neutral. You know, they shouldn't be good, but at least they should be neutral. You know what I mean? Need that pressure, loot, baby. <laughs> Uh, make sure to sabotage someone who's running and after they've been eaten act I don't know who kicked the knee before flea <laughs> all I'm saying is free steak steak sandwich should at least you know let me walk you out okay like it shouldn't it shouldn't make it good it should make it neutral because you know it's it's a steak sandwich in the apocalypse you gotta enjoy that steak sandwich, man. Just my oh my five cents. Move. Oh my God! Hey, I'm Velveteen. Thank you so much for that wonderful, wonderful, wonderful resub. That's twenty-four months. That is two years of me calling you Automaton Velveteen, Sir Automaton Velveteen. Night of the wholesome orders. Wholesome order. We're only one. I guess you could say we're a multitude. I don't know how it works. Point is, thank you. You got decked the night before and steak sandwiches would make it even. Yes, exactly. Make it even. Been up for far too long. The controller is charged. Anyways. Ugh. Point is, you know. Where do I meet them? No harm, no foul. Right. Also, I could really go for some fucking steak sandwiches, man. Steak would also be pretty expensive around here, I guess. I guess they just call anything red meat steak, Coronastern. You go up to the northwest. It's my guess. It doesn't look like they have any cows. Watch yourself. There's too many sightings of infected recently. Of course. I was gonna check out the creek trails. They would I'll need someone oh, else yeah. to cover it. Ellie, oh, you know yeah. Creatures? Not really. Dina's done it a bunch. I'll have the two of them take it. Toblerine, thank you not so much for that follow. You I are one and welcome to the wholesome order. You're Ellie, related to Toblerone? I'll talk to you for a sec. So, look, I don't know what's going on with you and Joel. Maria, the guy really cares about you. And I'm sure he didn't mean to. We're fine. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, so a lot of shit's happened over four years or something. Be safe. Thanks. Oh, you are related to Toblerone. Nice. Dina, assignments. <clears throat> Just give me a minute. Did you get your girlfriend Farm cattle are more than twice the mass of old wild animals on Earth. Until the apocalypse hits Tuna. <laughs> Then you, then you just need one bear smelling them, and it's game over, man. 
We're having Chinese all you can eat buffet before we go watch the show. Woo! Hey, Dina. Can I talk to you? <laughs> hey, guys. I'm tapping out. Come on. How long? Whew. Um, I just want to say sorry for running off last night. Oh, that's, it's okay. I totally get it. I, <laughs> I just, I felt bad. She's cute, though. Why? Because I, I started the whole thing, and I just, I shouldn't have kissed you in front of all of those people. I know, you were drunk, it's fine. Well, still, I just, <laughs> I don't want you to think. No, I'm not reading into it or anything. Just... You know what I love about you? How you let me finish my sentences. <laughs> All right. Well, we should probably get going. Yeah. Damn. Ow! What the fuck? I'm not even playing. Cause you're a chicken. You're a chicken. <laughs> the attitude. You wanna fuck them up? Yeah, I do. Yeah. You ask for it. You better run, you little shits. Holy shit! Get to cover. Go, go. <laughs> gotcha. We're on the board, <laughs> suckers. <laughs> Ow! I'm gonna come over there and fight you, like for real. <laughs> oh, you like that? <laughs> I see you. Oh wow, okay. I see you! Freaking Ow. Gatling gun! You that. Don't tell your mom. You think you should get me? Oh, dang it. oh you better hide. Jesus! No, no, you little shirt. Shirt. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Okay, these kids don't. What the fuck? These kids are insane, man! Just send, just send these kids out. Your parents don't love you. <laughs> Your parents don't love you. <laughs> Brutal, man. God damn. Oh, what a shot! Come on. Really? Ow! Yeah. I can't believe it. No. <laughs> Jesus, they are apocalypse and <laughs> Yeah. Get off of her, you monsters! <laughs> All right. All right. We actually have some work to do. Because the measure, dude, like these kids were. I guess wow. Wow. Huh? Yep. Let's go. I mean, it's like, have you guys read the story Jesse, about when uh, a bunch of U.S. Marines got ambushed by Norwegian children? Trails. He's gonna relieve George. Basically, three U.S. Marines started a snowball fight. Oh, man, I gotta, I gotta find this. I gotta find this. You guys, you need to see this. I have no idea. If it's true, but... Let's see. Okay, so there's a source. I don't think it's true, but it's so freaking well read. Okay. Um. <clears throat> all right, all right, all right, right. Okay, I'm gonna re I'm gonna read it, guys. We're gonna we're gonna tell we're gonna we're gonna have a bit of a break, and I'm gonna read I'm gonna read the story of how um, of what happened when a bunch of U.S. Marines met. <laughs> a bunch of Norwegian school kids on the field of battles. Okay, on the field of battle. Let's see. There we are. <clears throat> Swarming kids are no goddamn joke, man. True story, and yes, it's relevant. In the U.S. Marines, doing a mock war in the Norwegian city of Trondheim with the Dutch, Germans, and other allies training in urban combat, my infantry unit was positioned in a large soccer field next to an ele elementary school. Keep in mind, there was no actual combat, even simulated. It was mostly just practicing maneuvers and tactics, but we still looked at a place with weapons and gear, etc. It's fucking February, in Norway. Cold as balls, snow up to our knees, and Norway obviously has no snow days, so the kids roll in school. Anyway, 
So Norway has this most delicious and amazing delicacy. I have no idea what it's called, but it's basically a bacon-wrapped hot dog. It's filled with cheese, by the way. We had just assumed it was called Candy of the Lord. As Americans, we were naturally and instantly addicted. You find them at gas stations, and there just so happened to be one on the other side of the school where we were camped. A few of my fellow Marines and I requested permission to go to the gas station, and we set out on our way. We made it to right about where the main entrance of the school was, and the doors opened. School was out. There were only a few kids, probably six or seven years old. Lots of talking and laughing, gawking at us as we walked by with our guns and huge, ridiculous snow suits. One precious little bugger made shooting noises at us. We made shooting noises back. And then someone in my group, I don't know who. God help me, I don't know who. Someone threw a snowball and hit a little girl in the leg. And those little Norwegian children unleashed hell. There was a shrill cry in unintelligible Norsemen, and the doors to the school burst open. School children flooded out like a never-ending flood of something that never ends. Screeching, smiling, sprinting. How the fuck were they sprinting? Little bastards were slinging snowballs faster than the laws of physics should allow. It was like that movie Elf. If you can imagine riding in a fast car in a snowstorm and sticking your head out the window. Now imagine the snowflakes that are hitting your face of the size of snow balls we couldn't fucking see we couldn't run we could barely breathe holy fuck we tried to return fire and threw one maybe two half pack shitty snowballs that fell apart in the air arms flailing like drunk octopi i'm from texas we were a unit stationed in north carolina we were so outmatched and out of our element it only made them laugh harder we were cut off from our main forces we tried to perform a flanking maneuver but fuck me they were fast i think some of them were throwing rocks my comrades, I could see them speed waddling in their huge suits back to camp like the fucked up pair of white Teletubbies under withering fire. Fuck tactics! Fuck me! Fuck the candy of the Lord! This was survival! I was the slow one in the group. My snow boots were too big, but they were the smallest size they had at issue, goddammit! My marines <laughs> left me behind. I tried pulling my hood over my head and keeping my head down, no longer content to pelt my defenseless body with ballistic snow. The enemy swarmed me and dragged me down, cackling like a pack of hyenas descending on a wildebeest. I tried to sling them off by spinning. I came out of one of my boots and fell. I began to scream and plead for them to stop, but they neither understood nor gave a single Nordic fuck. They literally pinned me down with about five kids on each limb. It was then that I actually thought, oh shit. I'm really in trouble. My snow mittens were ripped off and flung into the trees. They started showing snow down my suit. Have you ever had anyone drop an ice cube down your shirt? Well, now imagine someone shoveling handfuls of ice cubes down your shirt. It literally shocked the breath out of my body. This is how I died. JPEG. GIF. They left me lying like a family guy accident victim, moaning and screaming in the cold, rifle packed with snow and dirt, boot buried some fucking where. They ran away laughing, jabbering in their crazy language. I lay there trying to figure out just what in the great American fuck it just happened. TLDR, Norwegians discover a way to defeat American Marines using bacon and small children. Life pro tip, don't ever, ever get in a snowball fight with Norwegian school tips. Today I learned... There are more names for shoving snow down people's clothes than should reasonably be expected. And thank you for the gold. Uh, yes, bacon person, it was filled with cheese. That is, that is very important. There you go. <laughs> Ooh, shit. <laughs> Ooh. How'd you enjoy the first one, Kalel? Masterpiece. Masterpiece in storytelling. And that's the story of how three Marines went up against um, a bunch of primary school kids in a snowball fight. And they learned that when you lose a snowball fight, you lose hard. There's no prisoners. There's no prisoners in a proper snowball fight. There's only snow filled jackets, despair, and crying. <laughs> <laughs> for those of you who are interested the candy of the lord they are referencing is a cheese filled hot dog so it's a hot dog filled with delicious gooey melty cheese and it's wrapped in bacon 
Now, I personally like that in, in a bun, in a sausage bun, with uh, either sweet or strong mustard, or, if I'm fancy, both, with crispy onions and potato salad. And when they refer to it as candy of the Lord, they're completely correct. It is the best road trip snacks known to man. The serious war tactics? Oh yeah, Kello. <laughs> you're from you're from Trondheim and you need to know which school this was at, Tublerin? I don't know. I don't even know if it's true. It's just a really, really well written story. Some big mouth kids challenged those big guys and the rest joined in. Think the guys got the rest of the hand getting a free return? Yeah, for sure. Uh, the strong mustard, dude. I, I'm a slave to the Dijon. The Dijon mustard. Dijon or get gone? Tommy. Oh, that's nice you assigned this together. You're gonna like this route. Oh, sorry. Also, also, honestly, guys. Hot dog? A proper hot dog? And I mean, like... I mean, like a proper fucking real meaty hot dog. I'm talking like a Five Guys, a Five Guys style hot dog, right? Like a meaty, beefy hot dog. Shrimp salad. Put shrimp salad on a grilled, proper, meaty hot dog. High quality hot dog. It is life changing. Heinz or Eden? Um, I'm not big on ketchup in general, Toblerine. I'm actually not big on ketchup in general. Joint Viking just went down up where, here where I am. I could be in trouble. That's true, Automaton. Dijon sauerkraut sausage? Ooh, yeah, Tuna. Now we're talking. None even. Listen, don't knock it till you tried it, you asshole! You fucking hate Eden? That's fair. Listen, I'm just saying, shrimp salad on a proper hot dog is good. It has to be the proper hot dog, though. Like, you can't do it with a bratwurst, for example. Um, it works surprisingly well on, like, a chorizo hot dog. Um, I meant for not liking ketchup. Listen, I like ketchup. It's just, I prefer my french fries dipped in mayonnaise, for example. Um, like, I like chili mayo and uh, sriracha, which is technically like a chili ketchup batter. Um, the only time I like need ketchup is for, you know, the candy of the Lord sausages, where I have mustard as well. French fries and vinegar? I mean, that's that's just old English, Tuna. That's just old English. Morning, girls. Morning. I feel like I feel like you would like a good English pub, Tuna. You know, get that fish and chips with the vinegar instead of the um, instead of the lemon to put on the crispies. Hey, Such a savory in. guy. Thank you. You're also kind of sweet. You're also kind of sweet, Tuna. I I I would I would describe you as a sweet and savory type of fella. Like fries and mayo? Yes, Nanners! I lived in Belgium for half a year. You learn to love high-quality fries and mayo. I mean ketchup, but in high school it was used to mix mustard, ketchup, and mayonnaise. Ooh, that sounds really good, Kalel. You know what's really good? Dijon senap and mustard. Make yourself a little Dijonese. Put that on a sandwich. Mm. Then again, I mean, you can't go wrong with Dijon mustard. Who's here? Nice. Oh my god, the way they talk to and care for their horses. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ketchup goes with almost everything. That's also true, Gamora. It's just not for me. Tartar sure. sauce is good too. Tartar sauce is pretty great. But you can't really put that on a sandwich, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One for you. There's a bullet in the chamber! Oh my god, they actually got magazines. Cool. Speaking of magazines, guys. Oh, who's the tuna? Who's the guy that Moist Critical has been having beef with lately? I don't care much about beef, 
but this was such a master class in how to just smack someone in the face and tell them to sit down, right? Sneeko, that's the one. Did you guys see the thing with the clips and the mags? Mwah. Mwah. He just rhetorically, strategically, tactically, in terms of knowledge and in terms of like, just being better equipped. <laughs> Just smacked him on every single level. Oh, holy crap. It was so great. Your best fish and chip was in Denmark? Any little bro? I was standing back then. The shop was straight at the harbor and the fish was... Oh, <laughs> Coronostern. Hell yeah. Sneeko is like a well-known idiot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was so funny because Sneeko was just posing so hard. And he was like dancing with his gun and shit and holding the finger on the trigger while it was loaded. I don't think he had actually chambered one, but. And then Moist Critical is like there and he's like, and I don't mean to get pedantic, but this is a mag. <laughs> so first he shows that he also has a gun and he knows how to use it way better than Sneeko because there's never, the finger never goes on the trigger. He always aims it, you know, he's always aware of where his, um, where the line of fire is. I don't know the English word for it. Uh, where the mouth, mouthpiece, whatever. Um, and everything like that. And then he just pull, pulls up a fucking rifle. <laughs> he's like, this is also a mag. <laughs> and that's where you remember that he is from Florida. And, uh, yeah. Jesus. Barrel and muzzle. Thank you, guys. But point is, he shut Sneeko down and just... It's just a master class in how to shut people down. It was so great. All right. You all know the drill. Run your routes, mark your logbooks, clear any infected you see. You run into anything you can't handle. You come back. Be smart about it. Because he basically met Sneeko on... Right. Sneeko's level and was better at it without pointing out that he was better at it. It's just it's just S tier. It's just so well done. What's your first language, Sarah Spicy? I'm uh, I'm Norwegian, sir. I'm Norwegian, sir. So my first language is Norwegian, my second is English, and I'm in the process of learning German. I can I can do Dutch. Passively, if you give me like two weeks to prepare and brush up on my knowledge. Nice little winter cabin. Sleeping with knives and weapons and shh. Okay, everybody's ready, everybody's routine. <laughs> Fuck is this then? I would not go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Charlie if I was a goober like that. I mean, if you were a goober like that, Tuna, you wouldn't know any better. Dude's just stupid. We didn't skip any time or anything, right? So this is a separate... Okay, so there's multiple storylines in The Last of Us 2, apparently. That's interesting. It's a nice braid, though. That's a very well-made braid. Hey. Woman. Hey. No name yet, okay? What were you dreaming about? Was I talking? Why is he covered in snow? You're doing your teeth grinding thing. How is he covered in snow if he's standing inside? Where have you been? Okay, yeah, no. Thank you for asking. Grab your gear. I want to show you something. What? She's beefy. She's got a strong core. Yeah, strong back. Strong back on her. But I like that she's, like... Come on. Honestly, that's how you would look if you were, like, a traveler during this time. It's cold. Granted, you you would need you enough sure food, you don't though. Do this when the so sun's out? 
I guess they eat well. Warmer? No. Can't wait. And you don't want to just tell me? You need to see it. Well, I have no idea what's going on or who these people are. But I am intrigued. Okay, so we're doing the we're doing the tutorial thing again. I see. What are you doing wandering around out here by yourself? It's just chilling. Living restless. his best life. Come on now. You too. I feel like the farther south we go, the prettier it's gotten. You wanna keep going? Just drive all the way to Mexico? I've thought about it. You can see Manny's hometown. <laughs> yeah, I don't see that living up to his stories somehow. I think Mexico would be better. <laughs> you know, the no wait, Mexico would be way worse. Yes. Mexico would be way worse. Holy shit. The cartels would be fighting for power. We keep going Jesus like Christ. This. We're gonna be tired for today's trip. It's not that far. Just a head cannon of mine? Alright, Dublin. Is Mel okay? She seemed out of it these past few days. She'll be fine. You stop being weird, you're freaking me out. I'm not being weird. Don't fall in the river, people. That's gonna be real cold for you. Yeah. Are you breaking up? They the all jump like a bunch of wet no. potato sacks. Just gotta be honest about that. Uh, I've had my fill. Just left of the Thank cartel? You. True. Oh shit. You're gonna have to run to make it. Turtles are fighting for you power now. I well, I mean, but like, I mean, proper Ouch. power, Kal El. Like, not just what is that? being the drug lords of a little region. I mean, like, literally carving out their own states. Literal nation states. You know what I mean? Hey, eyes on me. Abby. Abby is her name. Stop looking down. I like that they, they made it natural. Do we have to go back oh, this okay. way? They made it natural by like revealing their names. That's Consider pretty cool. Consider it an opportunity to work on your fears. You're just trying to be funny. Ah, okay. No, no, no. Like, you're, you're not wrong, kal -El. You're not wrong. I'm just... Stop flirting. Like, you would actually have Sinaloa Nation, <laughs> you know? In a post-apocalyptic situation with the cartels. You think English was a hard language to learn? That's a difficult question to answer, Sarah Spicy, because we started in school when I was like... When I was like six, we started learning English. Uh, and then I really liked it. So I never considered English to be difficult. I thoroughly enjoyed learning it as part of my base education. I feel like the cartel would survive better than governments. Yeah, because the cartels wouldn't try and find a cure. Second, the second you would get bit, if you were in the cartel, you're just like, you get bit, you get blat, like immediately. You were one of them? What do you mean one of them, Matsumaton? One of those who liked learning English? Because I loved it. We made it. Holy shit. It's a fucking city. Yeah. Are these nice? Have you told anyone else? I wanted you to see it first. It, are they looking for a nice, safe place to stay? I saw an armed patrol go from town to an outpost over there. A few more outposts in between. Electricity, guns. It's a lot of people. We can figure it out. Okay. Assuming he's in there, how do we get to him? Oh, God. Okay. Younglin. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, until it was uh, nine. Okay, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Um, right. So. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna try and trick myself here. I'm like 99% sure they're after Joel. We can corner one of the patrols and get confirmation and then... I don't know. Maybe find a way to lure him out. 
Yeah, okay. I'm sure they'll be happy to offer that information up. Well, then we make them. Do you hear yourself? Okay, what do you want to do? What is going on with you? Mel's pregnant. Oh. Looking for a long lost relative, right? Yeah. It's not just that, though. <laughs> Should I say congrats? When everyone else sees this, they're going to want to turn back. We can convince him, right? I fucking knew I couldn't count on you. Happy. I want what you want. What are we... But not at any cost. What are we doing here? Hey. Don't. See you back at the lodge. All right. So they're ready to torture someone for information about some shit. Fuck. Oh, okay. So she's she's one of those people. Okay. Let's get fifth grade. We're gonna change entrance here. Ah, okay. I see. I don't give a fuck. I'll do the whole thing on my own. Why, why would you, why, why do you want to delete the, what? Okay, well, I cannot wait to find out what this lady's motivation is. Also, I love the way she moves. It's really well, uh, it's really well designed. The way she moves is very much someone who is very confident in their physical abilities. Oh, okay, you can crawl now. Okay, that's pretty cool. Yeah, no, her entire way of moving is someone who is confident in being stronger. Yeah, like, isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? You alive? But see that that's what I that's what I mean, right? With uh with the uh, with the infected. You know in winter they freeze. You just you just hit them in the head. Just crush their freaking brains, you know what I mean? She's a fun character. I Suddenly, they started uh, introducing uh, non-linear storytelling. It's very interesting. She should be confident in her physical abilities. She's a beast. She is. She's pretty damn well trained. Yeah. You can tell by her posture and uh, her physique. Oh shit. Oh. Well, that's nasty. All right, we're good. Just had to look at a corpse. It's a very well designed. Oh shit! Okay, so I guess the infected don't. I guess the infected don't uh, freeze. And okay. Oh, you can dodge in this game or something? Oh shit! Okay. She's strong. Like, uh. is that beast? Oh, for sure. Can we just run around it? Rule number one, people. Cardio. Instead of wasting ammo on I me. Mean. Right. 
Any loot? Oh. oh, okay. So we can, yeah. I see. I see. I see. I swear, this game are related. I need to get a view. To the movie, the girl with all the gifts. Never seen or heard about that movie, real. Cheers, apples. We're handing out, handing out apples at Tom and Tom. It's very kind of you. Hello, tactical. It's good to see you. How do I get out of here? Oh, probably by going into the basement. Okay, no, we're crawling. Gotcha. Wraps her arm. Yeah. This is a bad idea, Abby. Then why are you doing it, Abby? We could. We could have been happy, Abby. We could have been interested in your story. Now, instead, I am scared. Of what's gonna happen? I want her backpack. It's a pretty, it's a pretty nice uh, backpack, Dublery. It's kind of like a uh, Mario's backpack. Definitely a must-watch movie. All right, take your word for it. Oh, we're good. Okay. It's gotta be close. It's gotta be. Close. What's what's her mot? What is her primary motivation? Okay, well, I like that the characters are a lot more uh, agile this time around. Honestly, that's that's pretty cool. Because uh, they seem kind of, you know, bleh <laughs> in the first one. Very heavy. Can we... Great. <clears throat> Move on, spoil the game so you can watch it on time. It only seems to be related. I oh, am. Yeah. No, it's probably not related, right? It's just one of those things. Ooh, Sound Twitter, thank you, Tactical. We're very stoked about it. I think it's weird that they can strangle them, but I feel like that's that's a bit strange. Okay, so Abby is pretty operative. That's a uh, good job her, I suppose. Thank you, Automaton. The zombie things are very similar, I see. <laughs> And Baba! <laughs> Insert coin clothing is a British gaming merch site? What? Oh, the. The backpack. That's pretty cool. Yeah, literally just the way she moves is like. She. She. She been. She been around. She been around. Imagine leather jackets being very use, very usable during. Uh, what? Oh shit! Oh, the sound is off. We need to. We need to restart this. Oh, talking merch. You definitely check out Sept's. True. Do we have the? Um, do we have the new gear? No, oh, okay. The uh, the waifu the waifu is coming. The waifu is coming. Eventually. <clears throat> if I had the choice, I'd be buried in something. <laughs> There are there's higher quality cotton for that tactical, but thank you. <laughs> uh, hey septic, do you want to show do you want to show the waifu uh, the waifu that's gonna get on the uh, get on the merch? Tuna. 
Tuna, uh, at some point somebody made a uh, made made fan art of me as a as an anime waifu. I'll be cremated either way. Solid. And uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put that pin up on merch because it's funny. <laughs> That's how you do it. There we go. Some nom nom. Oh man, they have that nice fridge up in here. Good for them, man. They have that nice fridge. Fuck, I'm so lost. All right, looking good, the waifu, right? Oh shit! You heard nothing, sir. Reload, you dumb. <laughs> All right, we're just. Okay, we can't jump up. Okay. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. Refresh and uh, restart. But yeah, um, we're gonna we're gonna do the. Um, we're gonna do the merch uh, thing and put the put the waifu pin up on there because that's that's gonna be funny. <laughs> do the death animations in these games, freaking brutal. But seriously, honestly, the infected running around, being just a okay with being frozen, like with with cold temperatures not a fan of that man <laughs> with the hang of those dodges oh yes yeah. sophie can we get a shout out to sophie darling it is very good to see you sophie i mean i mean toblerine i, I am a gamer you know what i mean We can only hope tactical. Guys, Sophie is an absolute treasure of a streamer. She is super nice, super kind, super caring. Shit. Got him, right? Well, that made me feel cooler than I actually am. I mean... Okay, I, I felt pretty cool there. That felt really cool. Rush one and just brap the other. Just blicky the uh, blick the other. Look at my Jessica's always. I, I clean up good, don't I? I'm sipping out of it at work. <laughs> I mean, hopefully they'll get some. Uh... Uh, they'll, they'll get some cups and stuff uh, added to the uh, selection eventually, Septic, but uh, who knows, right? Uh, how's your weekend been, Sophie? More strikes. Oh, no. I don't Where's like the this. Patrol? I don't like this at all. Gotta go see you later, Gamora. Have a fantastic rest of your Sunday. You need a beer mug? Dude, Dominator, that'd be great, man. I prefer for tomorrow. Got the eight the six fifty trend to Dublin. Jesus. Cue the ominous music. <laughs> oh my god. Come on. This way. Right behind you. <sighs> you Sorry. With him? Oh. With Jesse? 
<laughs> no. We've been together for so long. Look, Jesse's great. I love his parents. What? They will People still have parents? Family, but we were just on autopilot. Isn't autopilot well, good in the zombie stuff. apocalypse? Oh. I don't know. It didn't feel... You never really talked to me about Cat. Who's Cat? Yeah, because there isn't much to talk about. Yow. I just, I, I got the impression that you didn't really like her. <laughs> I don't care about her one way or the other. <laughs> okay. No, I think she's a talented artist. What? I've grown to like that tattoo of yours. Well, that's so big of you. And I oh, think is that the tattoo you were talking about, Zeptic? Interesting. Shut up. Okay. And jump! You can tie Shimmer up here. Shimmer? That's such a nice name. That's such a nice name for a horse. Oh, yeah. Hey. You want to see something spectacular? You're going to point at your face, aren't you? <laughs> Nothing is that spectacular. <laughs> oh, brother. Come on, stupid. Stupid. All right. There's a lot of parallel. No, no, no. Don't tell me that we're in the thing where they... That they are heading to. I'd be very sad if that's the case. Now you think of this view, huh? It's a nice view. It's pretty nice. Yeah, this route has its perks. Where are we signing? <laughs> Come on. Fuck. Why did she why did she go like Bleh. what what was the what was the problem there? Who do you used to do this route with? Jesse? Eugene. Right. Ah, oh, Eugene. Oh, man, he was funny. Oh shit. Oh, yeah. They're so casual about people who died. Damn. Huh? Alright. Grew up fast, didn't they? Plus, he taught me about rewiring electronics and stuff. Oh. I'll be that sharp at 73. Oh, no, he actually, okay. Yeah, we all make it to 73. He just, uh, okay, maybe, maybe he died from old age. That's pretty nice. Rosa Carmesi! Thank you so much wonderful. for that follow. You are wonderful, and welcome to the Holes I appreciate you. <clears throat> I, I have so many questions right now about this game. And, uh... So far, there's no answers. Sign us in. What was this place? Uh, it used to be a radio tower. Radio tower. <gasps> hey, I'm gonna guess this bong was Eugene's. Ha! Huh. That's mine. He gave it to me. Hey, do you have any on you, actually? Oh, I wish. <laughs> Eugene always had some on him. I'm not sure if getting high out in the middle, like, you want to get high where it's safe, right? You don't want to get high way out in the middle of risky territory. Unless you got to stay here for a few days, then you can get high on the first day. I don't know. That's a great little dancing emote, Rosa. The game over for me by now. I couldn't climb that rope or uh, over those things for the life of me. I mean, you would eventually get it, Septic. You would eventually get there. You're just gonna have to suffer and wait for the game to tell you, oh no. Weed high is not that bad, you can still focus. Yeah, yeah, I'm just saying, you know, in general, I wouldn't be so, I wouldn't be so casual about it. You know what I mean? It's like, they're, they're at work, right? They're here to do a job. Nothing wrong with getting high, you know, it's just, it's better when you have a proper time and place for it. Found a wild horse stuck in the ice, taking it back to camp. Ooh! One clicker in the basement, cleared it. Dead goat by sunny day's retirement. Found three runners inside, one runner along the main road. Snow's pretty rough. Gonna camp here tonight. 
Greg and Bonnie, Dina and Eugene, Jesse and Astrid. Kill three runners outside the suburbs, find a dead deer just outside the tower, looks chewed up, no infected. Okay, so the infected actually eat animals. River had flooded, all clear, so footprints from the small camp, two adults, one child. We'll be skipping next lookout, taking them straight to town. Clickers by the gas station, all clear, all clear. Right. And there. Come here. It was in the seventies, not to smoke if you wanted to. That's fair, Kal-El. That's 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 actually very fair. <laughs> Town up ahead's our last stop. Take a look. There's the town, with the big tower thing. Yep, that's where the next lookout is. Oh wow, okay. So uh, there was so much skipping next lookout. That a supermarket. Yeah. We'll pass that on our way into town. Ski oh, lift! Ski lodge. Oh, shit. That's no. Tommy and Joel's route. That's the one. Tommy and Joel's route? Oh, no. Oh, shit. I can see a storm. Gonna have some good sledding tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Oh no, that's where they were like chilling in the ski lodge at the top there. Oh god. Let's get back to the horses. Man, it's a slow burn in the beginning in this game compared to the previous one. Something popping out in front of the binoculars. Yeah, this game doesn't really Question. do jump scares, does it? Were you wearing those same clothes yesterday? They're clean. <laughs> no judgment. It's Patrol, Hola, Goose. You know, we're here to kill infected, not to look fancy. <laughs> Still look nice. <sighs> Thank you. <laughs> I'm great, Goose. It's good to see you. It's good to have you. Okay. Yeah, no, we've been here. Right. We got some ammo. We got some things. We got them. We got some things. Is there more loot here somewhere? Hey, Japan? What are you talking about, hey, Japan? Until Dawn. Have not, Toblerine. What kind of game is that? Is it one of those scary survival games? Oh, her horse's name is Japan. I see. Shimmer is a better name for a horse. In my opinion. Until Dawn is... Whoa. Oh, shit. They got it. Okay. Okay. Horror choice best story game. Wait, is it dark pick? Is it one of those dark picture anthology like things? Eugene. From a stroke? Oh, from old age. Yeah. Living a long life. Yeah. You? No way. Come on. You're way too reckless. <laughs> They're so casual about it. talking? They're so casual about it. Boots today. <laughs> you know how you're gonna die? <laughs> Ooh, let me guess. You're gonna kill me? <laughs> Did I ruin your punchline? <laughs> no. Maybe. Fuck you. <laughs> Sorry. I have a friend who has she has the exact same energy as Ellie in this game. Seriously. Not actually part of the Dark Pictures anthology. Okay, 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 okay. It's from the same people that made the quarry. Then I'm out. Because I fucking hated the quarry. Well, this cracked her arm at school on Friday and I get a cast. Nobody... And today I got a wish from a bucket list to draw on a cast. Drew on her arm Stan, Kyle, Carpenter, and Ken from South Park. Nice! That's cool. That's fun. No, the quarry ruined Hey, should we check these me. houses out? I really, really Seems did quiet, not like it. We can if you want. I bet they still got supplies. Yep. We are <laughs> always checking out the houses. The good one out of the two. Okay. Well, you know okay, about okay. this place. Then, then maybe. Just another evacuated neighborhood. Infected almost never make it out this far. We usually catch them on the outer perimeter. But I mean. What are you doing tonight? Uh. You, Ellie. Say you. 
thinking of inviting Joel to watch a movie. Oh. You guys good? Yeah. There we go. These trailers are neat. Nice little portable home. Mm -hmm. You think people really travel a lot in these things? Oh, well, wouldn't you? Right. I mean, if I'd lived pre-outbreak, yeah, I'd go see the whole country. <laughs> or travel to another country. Oh, Maybe that's cute. It's so cute. It's so cute the Jesse way they talk about, about these things. Canada. He said there's these like giant waterfalls out there he wanted to see. Big boy Joel really? back in town, this I assume. Hardcore Jackson guy. Everybody's got their dream. There's a what dark pic. Okay, watch? there we go. What's Joel into? Uh, Curtis and Viper Two. That's the one that's been on my radar for a while. Uh, oh. there is a dark pictures anthology in the final one. Now the quarry until dawn and the quarry aren't in the dark pictures. Butol are made by the same studio. Until Dawn is fantastic. It's S class. Okay, okay, okay. This doesn't tell. Yeah, yeah, of course, double. You know, we used to watch these cheesy '80s action movies. He's really into them. Oh no. I actually really like them too. What about you? What are you doing later? What's wrong with a cheesy action Some movie? Some people were talking about sneaking out, going sledding. <laughs> Sounds fun. Sneaking yeah. out. You want to meet up after? Uh, okay. Oh, shit. Maybe I'll play guitar for you. Dina. Okay. Dina's, uh, she, she's clear about what you want. Viper two about. Okay. Gotta respect so that. Two former commandos that go rogue to fight bad guys. Yeah. And I think in this one, they go up against Russian spies or something. Yeah. I'm more interested in this than I thought I would be. <laughs> There we go. Oh, what's this? Collectibles? Oh shit! Ooh, I don't have this one. Isn't it one of those superhero cards you're all into? That's awesome. Oh yeah. They actually started like collecting shit. That is awesome. <laughs> that is great. You think anybody out Old there is she now? I don't know, Goose. Movies? It says four years later, be. so I assume How eighteen you know? or nineteen. I mean, what if they're all just like us? Just surviving day to day. Well, I write new music, so... Someone had a camera. Wait, hold up. There are original Ellie songs? <laughs> Why haven't that's, you played any cool. for me? Well, she was collecting I, comics in the first one she was. I don't know. Come on. Will you play one? Did you get ready for tonight then? Yes, yes, yes. Mm. I'll think about it. All right, I guess uh, that was all the looting that was uh, available. Seems like. Right? I don't think I missed anything. Yeah. Unless there's somehow a sneaky, cheeky, breaky way up here. Yes, there was. Man, I'm good. Yoo-hoo! Right, where's your loot? There's actually a lot of pretty good loot that we're getting right now. It's pretty awesome. That's the thing though with playing on like harder on these games. You actually you actually need to loot goblin things. More attack and welcome to the stream. It's good to see you. Dear Santa, I, I was a good boy this year. Can I please have a big dog? I wanted to keep my daddy safe while he goes hunting for food. It could also help protect our house from the monsters. It, oh no. You could also help keep me company when my daddy closes himself in the bedroom. Here's what she should look like. Can you also get me a gun? I think if I was stronger, my daddy would be happier. Thank you very much, Eric. <laughs> no! Oh, buddy. Why game? Oh, that that really got me. Jesus. Oh, Eric, a good boy. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. Did you cut your beard shorter and hair and mustache? I just trimmed it all up, goose. 
You know, made it more, made it more precise. Hello, Howling Wolves. It's good to see you. God damn this game. Comes at your feelings with a freaking baseball bat. Christ! What the hell? The Captain Price from uh, Modern Warfare 2. Thank you, Goose. That's very kind of you to say. Price had a bigger mustache, though. I believe, if I remember correctly from that game. That's, that's high praise. What's the present part about the notes is the fact that they were never made it to the receiver. Yeah, Toblerine. Long sentence? Nah. With a howitzer? Yeah, <laughs> you're right. Looked like Pedro for a sec there while he tried not to yawn. Pedro Pascal? That's high praise. Oh. Blood! <laughs> Oh shit. Well, that is a mucked up moose, is what that is. What the fuck? Oh, that smell. Looks like infected did this. How many do you think it would take to bring down a moose? More than one. Oh shit. Where the hell are they? Let's go find them. Oh shit. Oh shit. Equip long gun? I'm not equipping no long gun. I'm very good with my short gun. Shit. I hear some inside. Oh, do you know? How the fuck did they get in there? More importantly, how do we get in there? Well, there it is. Jesus! I see a bunch of different tracks. Athena, this way. Okay. Uh, screw the freaking infected. Okay. We got the knife, right? Good, Ellie. So much better at it. Hello, howling wolves. I already it's down. already say hello. Said hello to you, didn't I? That's one. But I'm Let's I'm I'm happy to say hello again. One interview with Pedro Pascal, they talked about how people called him and one of them was Pedrito. Really, Goose, that's funny. He works low enough what they did to a moose. Yeah, more it's in your They're not making a lot of sense. How's your weekend been, Howling Wolves? Looking for some loot. No loot. I mean, he's been working for so long, you know, Zeptic. He really, he really deserves it. All right, that's locked. Great, it's perfect. Locked doors can usually be open on the other side. Probably not a good idea. Yeah, quick throw. And then we still have a nice, juicy crew and raiders. Welcome. My name is Subtacos. I try to make things in the counter plays, and I pledge my soul to your service. Should you ever need it, my sword shall be yours. Thank you so much, Juicy Boys. It's very good to see you. Oh my god, we're doing great today, Howling Wolves. How are you? Oh my god. F122? What's F122, guys? Tell me about it. Tell me about it, guys. If you want some Australian mega chaos, you need to check out the Juicy Crew. They are amazing. The juiciest Andy. It's good to see you. Good? you. Yeah. Nice throw, by the way. Thanks. We need we need loot. How was stream? How was stream to Formula barricaded. One? All right, all right, all right. That's awesome. That's cool. How'd that runner get in here? That's pretty. That's pretty. That's yeah. pretty stylish. That's a good question. Uh, but yeah, seriously, that's Juicy Crew is effective. a bunch of Australian streamers stream on the same channel sometimes at the same time, sometimes alone, and they got multi multiple multiple stream views, and it's amazing. The one I had with Joel a year or so ago. It was like oh, a dozen. 
you. Cleared about 20 once. There was a group passing through. Fuck. You cleared more than 20 percent. infected. What are you talking about, Ellie? Okay, well, that was that. No more loot. <clears throat> I hope you had a good time. Hope you had a good time, uh, Andy. Okay, no way to get back. That's all right. It's nice to see you, but I got a report to complete. Of course, of course, of course. You, you go, you go do your thing. You go do your thing. There we go. Big raising wheel on my desk tonight. Okay. <laughs> That's nice. Oh. oh shit. Let's keep it quiet. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Incredibly violent with that stiletto. It is magnificent. And stab the bank. Man, they have the routine. I just want to do a full-length Formula 1 season. Oh, shit. Yeah, why not, right? Good NPC. Oh, yeah, no, for sure. Same septic. Please, Dina doesn't stand around watching. I mean... Ellie was a child in the first one. And, I mean, she would give you, like... You're not going over it, right? And, you know, she would give you health packs if shit was dire. So, uh, I see what you mean, but, uh, you know, you gotta, you gotta be nice to Ellie in the first game, my friend. How you been? I've been, I've been emotionally abused by The Last of Us 1, and now I'm getting emotionally abused by The Last of Us 2, Andy. Also, Andy, did you see I'm engaged now? I'm gonna get married. To the love of my life. That all of them? Yeah. Looks I like just, it. I just want everybody to know that I'm We're engaged. I'm going to get married. Let's keep circling the so, building. like, if you just like to watch from the side, that that is true, Paprika. That is true. I mean, people are into that, and we don't kink shame here. Consensual kinking is more than okay. Use a word in the English language to explain how happy I am for you. <laughs> Ecstatic. Jubilant. Australian. <laughs> Congrats again, man. Thank you, Tuna. Guys, we found a we found a castle in Austria. <laughs> Close to Lady Sept's hometown. That we're gonna get married at, actually. We landed we landed the venue Ellie, earlier this week. Help me up there. I wanna look around. It was, uh, pretty great. <laughs> Are we changing uh scrolling ladies up to Queen Sept? No no no. Still it's still Lady Sept. Don't you don't you worry about that. Where did I tell Dina to go? Dina Oh my oh. god! Juicy hey, no! Coming in. Oh, This uh, might be a good sub. start to explain how happy I am for you. Freaking Prime Gaming sub making you so juiciest Andy. Knight of the Wholesome Order. Thank you very much, sir. That is very, very kind. Oh, I need something new to put my sword on soon. Because my current thing is, uh, is, is struggling. Okay, so I'm, I'm literally just looking for loot, guys. Okay, there's no more loot. Let's go. All right, go ahead. Pog champ. <laughs> Speaking of Pog champ, is the newest Mandalorian season any good? Um, there's a hole in the roof over there. Here. Oh yeah. By the way, did you guys see the video explaining how hard it is to pull someone up like that? Thanks. Especially if they don't help at Look, all. <laughs> see? All right. Let's figure out how to get in there. Almost through the book? What? The Mandalorian? What what book what book automaton? I haven't I haven't seen yeah. the newest episode of the Mandalorian yet. Uh, no new season. So I, I don't know, I just want to see what people find, find about it. Send you for a sword. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Ellie? 
Are you clean? Yeah. Oh, she Just doesn't know. That. Please die of old age and not because you get infected. I really don't want to have to shoot you in the face. <laughs> <laughs> Deal. Cool. Okay, so she's she's pretending. Or she she's keeping it secret. I mean that makes sense, I suppose. You have so many more emotions to feel. Gee, thanks. I am uh, not ready for it. Last episode, the newest one, Jessica, in the newest season. Thank you for weighing in, though. That'd be incredibly difficult. Oh yeah, and pulling people up, dude. Like, I train a lot, and even I oh my god, we're just getting more and more friends coming in. Mads and Raiders, welcome. My name is Subsequus. I try to make the internet a candor place. I pledge my sword to your service. Should you ever need it, my sword shall be yours. How are you guys? And how was Hogwarts Legacy treating you, Mads? Guys, Mads is an absolutely fantastic streamer. Streams uh, streams a lot of good games. Loves loves them some Avatar: The Last Airbender. And you know, you know, it's great. It's great when you find people that love The Last Airbender. You love it so much. I've I've heard a lot of I heard a lot of good things about it from people that like uh, that like the Harry Potter stuff. So I'm ha I'm happy for you, Mads. Fashion, interior design, and cute animals. That's all you want from a game, isn't it, Mads? So to God for what I did, I wasn't going to hurt you. I didn't want anything from your store except for the drugs. Your husband came at me. What choice did I have? My little sister stopped feeling her feet. I needed the insulin. Everyone is hoarding the stuff. What choice did I have? I hope he survives. I'm sorry. Bullshit. Dude, the notes, man. The notes hit like a... Uh, Fucking truck. You see any way to that roof? Uh, not sure. Uh, up on this thing, dumbasses. Huh? You know that, or we go under here, and then we go up on this, and then we go up on this, and then we go up on this. And then we one, two, three, hey! <gasps> While you're holding a gun for whatever reason. Put that shit away. This way. Can't feel my feet. Oh no. I can't feel my feet when I'm with you. Uh how's how uh, which which house did you get into Matsbu? Did we get a shout out from Matsbu? We did get a shout out from Matsbu. I'm a professional streamer, by the way. Oh my god. I'm in. This is the first unspoiled playthrough, by the way, guys, so please behave yourselves. Don't do none of that. Hey, got some alcohol. A couple of rags. Here. Fix yourself up. There we go. So now we can craft the health kit. That is awesome. What were we talking about? I don't know. Yes, this game. I'm completely unspoiled for this playthrough, and I'm. I'm just in there. not ready. On. Got it. For these things that happen in the game to happen. Being a bad mod it doesn't give shadows. It's not. A, it's not about being a bad or a good mod. I was just, you know, sometimes I miss it. You know. What's happening in the game, Ill yeah. Illo? Can we get a shout out for your boy you Illicent, face. please? Please, 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 and thank you. Earl, my last insulin across the room, breaking it. Oh shit! Tactical. Are are any of the newer places close to you nearby that uh, have cheaper insulin open near you? Please, please get yourself some insulin. Um. I'm, I'm, I'm. Uh, we're, we're just at the start. We're just at the start, oh, Illu. That's so sweet. We're just at the start. All these spores mean they've been here for a while. Keep your eyes peeled for older infected. Yep. So where am I supposed to go? I don't know. Because I want to go. I think we're above it. I want to go. Let's get to the ground floor. An another way. Oh. 
certain things in this game. The pen still costs a metric fuck ton. Oh, I see. What's happened so far? Uh, we just got backstory to the people that uh, still are alive. Yo, Kristen left the real shit in the safe for you. Combo's the date. My good boy got employee of the month. Don't sell them and give them away. That's for your back. All right, feel better. Okay. Somebody got employee of the month. My good boy, the dog. When did the dog get employee of the month? Where can we see? Okay. Employee market of the month. July. 2013. So that is... Oh, seven July. That's the seventh. Seven twenty thirteen. Then seven. Twenty. Thirteen. Yes. Hell yeah. Oh, shit. Hell yeah. Have we met uh, Abby? We've seen Abby so far, but I... Like, I guess she's a new character. I don't know what uh, her motivation is or anything like that. She's looking for someone. I have a sneaking suspicion. It's gotta be Joel, because she was talking about, like, torturing a scouting party and shit. And I'm like, the only reason to be mad at someone in that city is if they, you know killed a bunch of fireflies in a murderous rampage throughout an entire hospital I'm just guessing we'll find out oh my god also also there's so many great freaking uh, streamers in chat right now you got tuna you got mads boo you got your boy illicent there's so many so many great streamers in here just absolute legends to each and every one of them faster health wait i need to what can i learn okay but okay so these are locked so i can just upgrade down okay so i need to upgrade movement speed then faster health kits then increased health all right game i guess i guess we're doing it your way says you listen real recognize real man i'm just saying there's so many talented streamers here in chat and i'm honored and awestruck by just the sheer amount of talent i have the pleasure of knowing after after these four years on twitch i think i think it's a beautiful thing and it's one of those things that i remind myself of when uh, you know the motivation is lacking good morning snorps welcome to the stream i hope you slept well i'm not talented i just enjoy my timer i'm sure you're great kalel listen everybody's talented at something and even in the off chance that you're not talented at something, you can just work really hard at it and get good at it through hard work instead. It's a progression tree. Okay, Angry Midget, got you. Had some fantastic sleep. There you go. Oh. Well, that's bad. Oh, uh, is it gonna be like a big loader? Alright, two to the face. If necessary. Oh god.
We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. My talent includes injuring myself. I hope you mean accidentally, kal -El. Otherwise, I'll, I'll have to gently tell you to get professional help. You're quite a nice little person to have in the background while doing stuff. Thank you, Unicorn. I'm happy. I'm happy that I, uh, I, I'm a good source of uh, lurk deliciousness for you. Please, please don't joke about these things, Kalel. It's uh, you know, don't don't make me worry about you. I mean what I say when I say that you know every single person in the world makes somebody's day better from the simple act of existing. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> Not like that. Okay, got gotcha, you, Kalel. Jesus. Okay, so they made they made clickers a little bit more scary than in uh, the previous game. Oh shit! Sorry. Okay, I thought uh, okay, that's okay. Then you can go troll now. I gotta get rid of that damn. <laughs> well, that's a great talent, Kalel. Honestly, some people will just let it stay infected and painful for a long while. You don't, you don't want to be that person, you know what I mean? Clickety clack. I'm deleting your bag. An angle grinder though? Depends on the toenail, doesn't it? The more clicks you hear, the more hugs you need to give them. Ah, this is, this is good wisdom. Coming on Mads' raid. Nice to meet you. Last of us two, Poggy. Oh, it's very Poggers. Okay. Look out! Okay. Excuse you, game! Whatever. Was it a deep hoof cavity? No, that is nasty. I don't. I don't have a need to see that. Can't have those and still work. That's true. Okay, so these things here, me. Montana Recreations, thank you so much for that follow. You are wonderful. You are wonderful. And welcome to the whole summer. I appreciate you. Abby's got them big red red guns. I mean, the thing about Abby, right, is that that's a physically active physique if you get a shit ton of exercise and enough food right roid it out not at all just decided to flip itself around that's okay Oh. It's like, yeah, I yeah, move quietly and all that, but like, there's still. Oh, that did nothing. There we go. All right. I took care of that. Oh, fuckers make my skin crawl. That make things easier, Let's but make sure the rest of the building's cleared out. It's a bit of a and then get the fuck bit out of, of a waste of ammo. Speak in my language. But yeah, like I said, not roids. Just you know, you know, peak peak human physical condition, if given enough food, which I think is a little bit like, I mean, so food is not scarce. I suppose, in this universe. Because it seems to me that everybody's eating pretty damn well, which I'm Ellie. actually kind of surprised by. Found the door. Help me out. Could we have just From snuck the past them? Probably, maybe. 
Le nice last minute shot. Thank you, Angry Midget. I appreciate that. Fiance. 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 Girl, girl fiance. Girl fiance. How are you? Boy friends. Boy fiance. Fiance. <laughs> what you I want just... for dinner? We have some in the freezer right now. Okay. I don't want tasty. Oh, you already had something tasty. Yeah. I see. We can have some. What do you want? It's tasty. It's stingy. Tell me what you want. You you said munchies burger earlier today, and you I was like, and burger? I was like. I could go for a burger. You want, you want burger? Yeah, tasty burger. Burger? Tasty burger. Yeah. You look very happy. I look very happy. Yeah. They're all saying they're all saying hello and they're saying congrats and. Hello. Yes. Hello and congrats to everyone watching. <laughs> and uh, Septic found a cardigan that looks like Alina's uh, kefta from Shadow and Bone. We can eat burger and watch Shadow and Bone today. Close. <laughs> hey Skeggs! You're looking you're looking fresh today, my dude. Uh, I have to take a drink. Uh, bake a cake? I have to bake a cake now. Okay, go bake, bake a cake, cake now. Bake a cake. Bake a cake. Bake a cake. <laughs> Think what kind of burger you would like for dinner then? I want the one with blue cheese. The one with blue cheese, you want the Munch's signature burger. That's yes. the one you want. Yes. Yeah. Remember when we had it the first time? Oh, it was yeah, when we were slightly drunk. <laughs> it was great. After the smell of death. Yeah. <clears throat> I want that. But we're only gonna have them in like a couple of hours. Two, three hours? Yeah. After I'm done streaming. We do the Orden and then they arrive. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then we chill with Shadow Bone. Shadow Bone. Shadow Bone. I gave oh. a bag of coffee to this girl, so she could... A bag of coffee. Yeah. Nice. Because we have some. We do, we do have a lot of coffees. Coffee. But I'm going to make one now. Do you want a cup? A cup of coffee? Yeah. Uh, No, I'm good. What time is it? 15.26. Is it too late? It's a little bit late for coffee. Uh, but you want, you, want something, you want something to drink. You How can, about water? You can also drink water. Or you can run to the store and get yourself. No, like I'm not going to juice. anywhere. I've been outside all day. All day. All day. Yeah. Not even getting a booba. Yoga tea. in a class. I went to a yoga class. I went to a yoga class today. You guys in a studio in Oslo with a quite famous Swedish comedian, actually. I didn't know how famous he was. But the thing was, he taught, but he brought his dog. <laughs> he had a dog in class. It was like a flat coated red reaver. It was a black. Red That's reaver. adorable. And it was the cutest dog. And sometimes it would like people were in down dog, you know, when you stand on your hands and feet in a triangle thing shape. And the dog would just slid underneath people and just lay down there. And he had a ball. And sometimes he would like nudge people when they were like in certain poses with his ball. And we're like, hey, can you throw my ball, please? <laughs> so funny. <That's> cute. <laughs> and there were like people in certain like runners lunch and the dog came by and just started licking their face like just frontal licks it's like <laughs> so funny really really cool especially because i didn't know there would be a dog because i'm a former yoga teacher that never reads the descriptions of classes before i book them yeah <laughs> but, but you had a good time i had a very good time dog. yeah and it was a good training too and it was a very good training of Staying aware in a moment because if there's a dog running around, it's really difficult yeah. <laughs> to stay focused and balancing poses when there's a dog nudging your foot. That's cute. Really cute. And then we had pizza. Yeah. And salads. We talked about life. Life? One of my friends moved, the other met a guy, and one is struggling very, very much in a difficult situation. Oh. Yeah, but it's really good. And we talked about our engagement. Engagement. We're coming to our wedding. Yeah. Mm, they were really excited. That's good. 
So uh, it was a good mix of life. Hardship and beauty. And now I'm going to go bake a cake. Okay, enjoy. Mm -hmm. Cake baking. Right. Uh, uh. I, I kind of I kind of like the parts of the stream where we put everything on hold just to hear how Lady Sep's day has been. I'll make you a present. I'll take a present. I think I think they're good. I like them. You sometimes shop at EMP? What kind of what kind of stuff is EMP? Is it just nerdy nerdy uh, thingamabobs, thingamajigs? Nerdy merch. Oh. Hoo hoo hoo! Here. Molotov! Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This, yeah, the cloth goes through it. That's great. Very nice. Poodle. Careful with that. I'm a pro. We're not done. Alright. We got 25. Alright, we got all the stuff. Alright. Not just for games and movies, but music as well? Okay. Okay. Is it like a... Is it like a certified partner service thing? Or what's... It's got band merch, merch, gothic stuff, normal clothes, decorations, drinks. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Also, Skig, sometimes it's too late for coffee. But it's so late that you're going to have a hard time sleeping. Then it's too late for coffee. Got some numbers here. Here's what I'm thinking. How many of them are there? Like, if I throw this over there, you know, and then I throw this, then gather you asshole over here. There we go. Burn, you little chips. Okay, it seems like they beefed up the clickers a lot. Molotovs are from this and Curly Dancer, welcome to the stream. Hey, Cur Curly, I don't, mind, I don't mean to be that guy, but did you have a partner tag the last time you were in here? Because if you didn't, congratulations, Curly. Did you get a partner? Or have you been have you been partner for a while? Are you are you a fresh new partner? Curly, I'm so sorry. I'm really trying to just got him to see. Yes! That's what I thought! That's what I thought, Curly! That's awesome! Congratulations! That's what I thought! You look great in purple, Curly. Guys, can we get can we get some hype in chat for Curly? Getting getting the hallowed partner badge, the check mark. Also, you're playing Cyberpunk 2077, and the story behind that game is like the the story in that game is absolutely fantastic. Man, I'm so happy for you. Still feels weird having it. Yeah, dude, that's that's how I feel about my. Engagement you are wonderful. with my girlfriend or my fiance now. I got I got engaged two weeks ago. You see, Curly. <laughs> so we we both achieved something the last two weeks. <laughs> of course, of course, your achievement is way better because you know Twitch is more important than real life. That is that is something everybody. Knows. Oh, he's so interested. Thank you, Curly. Also, Ethan. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Also, Ethan W2995. Thank you so much for that follow. You are wonderful and welcome to the Awesome World. I appreciate you. Twitch isn't real life. That's what I'm saying. Twitch is real life. You know what? But, like, a more important version. Yeah. Man, the guys are not going to believe our numbers. Uh, but yeah, so many, so many people. Let's go to the next lookout. 
just it's absolutely okay. crushing it these days. I think I think it's agreed. It's incredibly motivating to see. More important version, yes. Twitch is more important than life. You can quote me on that. Twitch and video games, more important than life. Always, always prioritize, prioritize video games and Twitch over real life. That's just, that's just good wisdom right there. Is life advising yet behind? No, 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 no. L once again, you know, life less important, Andy. Gaming and Twitch, more important. So this is gaming advice you can get behind. You know, you gotta be, you, get, you gotta maintain, you gotta maintain the message. Agree. Yes, yes, everybody, everybody agrees, good. Everybody agrees that we should. We should always make sure that we play more video games than we interact with real life. That is that is that is how you become successful. Yeah, damn it. Twitch advice. Yes, yes, exactly, exactly, exactly. All right, that was all the loot. And uh, welcome back, Explain Seven. I'll see you there, Ellie. Ellie Po. Ellie Poil Bib. That's way too hard to say, Ellie. I'm just gonna call you Ellie, okay? You gonna catch some Zeds, dude. Please sleep, Tuna. And uh, thank you so much for stopping by. You're okay. you're a freaking legend need. in the making. And you I can't wait to see what you get up to. Me up through that hole in the roof. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna just... No. Okay, that didn't work. So how are we gonna get you up to the hole in the roof? How do we get up there? I'm guessing in through here. Uh, nope. That's actually not it. Surprisingly enough. Just the alley is fine. I'll do, I'll do my best. Hmm. 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 Freezer? No. Okay. No freezer. How the fuck? I said, how the fuck? Oh, here, right. Hey, the cable. A cable. What are we doing? Wait, what are we using the cable for? What's happening? There we go. That looked like a great way to lose your arm. Yeah, that should hold us. What? Are you what? Get over it. Fuck yeah. What are we? What? <laughs> that was ballsy. That was stupid. Okay, that's good. Here I go. Oh, you're doing the thing? <laughs> All right, look at you go. Yeah, I got that back strength, brother. Still can't get over how happy I am for both of you and Lady Seven. Remember, my friends got married being one of the grooms. Those are going to be crying in public, so happy for you. I've been crying in public since we got engaged. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. Made it out. That looks like it should have just broken. Can we go to the other? No, no. Okay. Wait. What? Oh, Ooh, that's stupid. Storm's really picked up. Yeah, find some shelter. How far are we from the lookout? <laughs> I'll let you just, just release right. <laughs> oh, oh, there you. was one puzzle in Half-Life 2. That was like... What was it? It was so stupid. Where you had to get... These floating things underneath, like a platform or something. Hey, you had to do that like we? eight times or some bullshit. Oh man, in retrospect, not a good experience. <laughs> I mean, great game for its time, but like if you replay Half-Life now, you're like... Yeah... I guess it's I can see worse. what they liked back in back. the early noughties, you know? We're almost there. Honestly, like, don't they have better winter clothing, winter gear? 
They should seriously have better winter gear. I'm just saying. Oh no. Oh no, this is where the fucking fuck was. Wasn't it? There you go. Oh God. Come on. Jesus, I thought, I thought, okay. So now that there's a fake out with the rug pull, I'm like 90% sure it's gonna be, there's gonna be another rug pull very soon. That little labber. Now you pat down that horse. I'll get the door. Pat down the freaking horses. I need to see some. I need to see some brushing. I need to see some brushing of these of these horses, man. Here? Rode by it. Never came inside. All right. Take care Let's of the freaking sure horses, clear. man. Come on. I I would be completely fine with a little mini game here where they pat down the horses. Honestly, I'm just saying. Chrome, be proud. Of you. <laughs> oh my God, my freaking ear canals, man. Okay, always check the desk. Uh, let's see. I mean, you just know that these characters have freaking glutes of steel, man. They're just walking around crouched all the time. They're doing their squats. That's for damn sure. Did the developer know for the PC release in 10 years? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, at least we're getting the first one, you know? At least we're getting the first game for PC very soon. But then again, you can also just play that on PlayStation. So. Doesn't feel like anyone's been oh, here shit. in a while. I gotta see what's back here. But I just want the record to show that, you know, console exclusives are stupid. Or platform exclusives are just stupid. All this electronic stuff? This has to be Eugene's. Uh, are you sure? Yeah, nobody else would tinker with this shit. I hate platform uh, exclusives. My apologies, but I have to head out now. Yes, see you later, Septic. And Django Doe, thank you so much for that follow. You are wonderful and welcome to the wholesome order. I appreciate you. Huh. Firefly medallion? Eugene Linden. Oh, he was a firefly? Eugene's place. He was a firefly? Damn. He served with Tommy. Oh, okay. Cool. I had no idea. Yeah. They got into some real dark shit. Like what? Damn. He said he blew up a checkpoint at Denver QZ. What? Killed three soldiers and two civilians. Jesus. Jesus. That's what I said. He also told me that he and Tommy slow tortured some big Fedra general. Oh, that's fucked up. I don't know. I, I don't buy Tommy doing that, though. He could do worse. What do you mean? Angel did a lot to survive after the outbreak. Oh. I don't know, man. Like, is this shit you share about others? You know, in the post-apocalypse? I don't know. Oh my god, look at all these comics. Ellie should be besides herself. This is a treasure trove. That's treasure. Alright, there we go. Just a whole bunch of loot in here. Or not loot, but... Oh. My ears are finally clearing up after being just full of all sorts of blah. Oh my god. It's Tommy and Eugene. Oh, they're cute. They look like babies here. From the start. Oh my god, that's from the start of it. When Tommy was young and Eugene must have been in his like late 40s. Peters. Early 50s. There's gotta be a generator around here somewhere. That's, wow. Eugene must have been a cool character, man. Really wish we could have met him. 
Oh shit. Eugene, I'm begging you to come home. The Fireflies want to save the world. I say let them. Let them go after the military, the politicians. Don't develop a vaccine to save mankind. Maybe one day we'll have to see the fruits of their fantasies. I have to put our daughter first. The Fireflies will be fine without you. Your daughter won't. She keeps asking me when you're coming home. I can't lie to her anymore. I don't know how much more this can take. Come home, please. We love you, Claire. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, that's really sad. <laughs> this fucking game, man. Come on! Oh, that's so mean. That's so mean. Found the generator. Oh. Oh no. Oh, that's butter. Oh wow. Impressive work, Ben Eugene. Ooh yeah, because we found all the you loot. Your gun with this gear. Is Elia badass as well now? She can just she can just fix her shit. Ooh hoo, hoo, yeah. Well, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, we, we can get a six time scope. That's interesting. Um, always capacity, man. Always capacity. Think capacity on this one first, and then we're gonna check the other one. Capacity four. Oh shit! There's only one. Okay, so it's not okay. It's not like minuscule levels. Like uh, in the first game. All right, I see. Yeah, I see. Work. No, no, I'm not done. Okay. Well, apparently I'm done. <laughs> right. How many bullets now? Ooh, nine. Very nice. Oh, hello. Hello, what? Look at the floor. There's more stuff down there. <gasps> you see a way down? Uh, not here. All right. Time to find a way down through the roof, I suppose. Or do we just clickety clack? I don't know. It felt impossible. Yeah. I I'm a loot goblin, so I found a lot of uh, parts. But, uh, even I didn't get to upgrade everything. And also, like, some of the- some of the guns... You barely used because you never fucking found ammo for them. Suplex the floor? I mean, for most problems in life, there is suplex. It's almost a loot, so we do love ourselves some loot. Well, it's obviously a sex den. That's why he didn't tell you about it. I hope it's a sex den, for his sake. <laughs> he was so lonely, man. Oh. Weed? Oh my god. It's weed. That's a lot of dead weed. This explains... Yo! <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. God damn, man. We need to we need to run a restart of the capture card. The mother of <laughs> me. Can you imagine? Dude, that is now that is a freaking That's how you do it, man. <laughs> That's freaking awesome. <laughs> Oh, sorry for yawning so much, guys. I just, I just finally got enough sleep this weekend. And for some reason, when you get enough sleep, you start yawning more. <laughs> oh, man. Grow a lot of other food and stuff, too. Yeah, I mean, I, I definitely wouldn't prioritize weed, but apparently he did. So, you know, good for him, I guess. Hey. He's got that videotape thing. Huh. 
song of the oh, no. wolf. Smash Brandy's cooch. Oh no. Are these she's <laughs> porn? <laughs> Smash <laughs> Brandy's cooch. It's a Smash Bandicoot. <laughs> porn parody. <laughs> In taste, Eugene. All right, Naughty Dog, I see you. <laughs> naughty Dog putting the naughty at the forefront of their design philosophy. That is great. Maria would lose her shit if she saw this place. How'd he get this together? Must have taken him forever. Yeah, damn. <laughs> Skiggs is like. I see you found my hidden underground post-apocalyptic base. Please don't take my weed. <laughs> Dude, what the hell, man? Ooh. Oh! Some pre-rolls! Uh. Some freaking pre-rolls! Noise. Oh, there we go. You think it's still good? Does weed go bad? <laughs> mm. Let's find out. It definitely goes dry. I can tell you that much. You having a hard time? No, I got it. <clears throat> Fuck. Give me that. Oh, yeah. Like you're gonna get it. <sighs> okay. <It's, laughs> yeah. Heat up the metal. <sighs> Fuck it. Oh! We drilled the TV series what yesterday, so good. What is wrong with you? I got it open, was didn't it, I? So, so it was great, explosive. Would you recommend it? This smells good. Take the rest of it! Come on, they're being wasteful! I mean... Gonna be stuck here a while, right? 100%? Alright. Add it to the pile. Totally trapped. See, this makes sense, you know? Because she said Eugene always had weed, you know? And now... Can I ask you a question? Now they got nothing to do but wait out the snowstorm. Oh, okay. So why not just, uh, you know, blaze it? Not with a Zippo. Scale why not with the Zippo's gigs? One being, like, absolute trash. Why not with a Zippo? Is it because the being... paraffin? Life altering. How would you rate? All it is the butane. Okay, got gotcha, you, got gotcha, you, got gotcha, you, got gotcha. you. Why are we still talking about this? See, guys, that's why I prefer cigars it because it doesn't matter what you light it up with; it's still Did gonna I taste say like that? a cigar. Come on. A six. <laughs> a six? Dina is good. Dina is good. Wow. Like a solid six. Okay. There are a lot of people around. Yeah, but six. Oh. What? Dina is good, right now, man. I really want to know how you'd rate it. I don't think you do. You're infuriating. Have you met you? Hey, Dragon Lineman, it's good to see you. You make me want to go back outside into that blizzard. <laughs> Don't want to stop right now. Now kiss! This better be better than a six. Well, of course it is. You guys are high. <laughs> <laughs> High smooching is better than drunk smooching. Facts. Sober smooching better than both. My personal opinion. What are they doing now, Dad? They are... 
getting romantically intertwined. Is Ellie eating her face? I mean, that that is a synonym for it. Everything is better. Hi, everything is better than drunk anything. I don't know, man. I I feel like things are funnier. For me, for me personally, things are funnier when I'm drunk. Oh shit. Okay, I thought, uh, oh god! Okay, okay. I'll see you there again. Oh shit, they're still coming! Oh. What? Are you kidding me? Seriously, they, they, they jump like moist canvas bags oh. oh that's cold well you're dead and if you're not dead it's just a matter of time like unless you can keep up this pace and just keep yourself nice and warm oh shit Seriously, they, they jump like wet canvas bags. I, mean, I can't. I can't with their freaking complete lack of jumping skills. Nice mustache, Shinobijo. Thank you so much, Shinobijo. I appreciate that. It's very kind of you to say. Ellie's gonna be eating something. How dare you, Tactical? Angry Midget, how dare you? Don't, don't do this. Don't do this to me. Is it the dichotomy of the term? Eating a woman. <laughs> Parkour! <laughs> Oh. Loot. There's always time for loot. There's always time for loot, my bullies. Oh shit! Well, just just be gentle about it. Oh, oh this is my pick. Shinobijo, thank you so much for that follow. You are wonderful and welcome to the whole story. Behold, I'm not going to do it. Oh, Oh my god, okay. Oh shit! Hold up! Great thinking, Tommy! Good luck, Tommy! Good luck! Finally, someone goes left right! <laughs> oh, I was in with crap is being around their backpacks. That's also fair, I suppose. Okay. But like, yeah. use momentum, crying out loud. Where the hell they all come from? It don't matter. What it does is where we going. I reckon we go out the back. We can make a break to the lodge. I ain't got a better idea. Hey, you got a gun? Yeah. Well, I hope you're a good shot. Keep up with us. All right. We gotta warn everyone. Come back with a cleanup crew. We gotta live through this first. Watch them windows. Oh. Nice. Oh, shit. Damn it. They're everywhere. We got them up. Get to the door. Just running straight in their line of fire, like a goddamn professional. <laughs> ah, fuck. Oh my god. We need to hurry. That is amazing. Brothers never abandon each other. That's for damn sure. Up there, the window. That's our way out. You see a way up there? Here, use this. Need a thing? Oh, what? Are you kidding me? Hey, girl, give us a hand with this thing. Okay. 
Push it up onto the cart. All right, all right, all right. Oh, that helps. You're getting inside. I'll get the gun to the, to the window. You two keep those infected. Okay. Yeah, no. Watch out. Oh, oh, shit. Is heavy. Oh, oh, shit. Okay, well, we're dead. Hey, girl! I mean, they don't know her name. They don't know that her name is Abby, right? I need to get used to the fact you can dodge that bullshit. with Joel not making it up. Okay, Joel made it up. Joel's a badass. Forget. Forget, forget, forget. Miss this one. Come on. Oh. 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 Click, 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 click. Head for those doors. Through here, let's go. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. about this, are we? Please don't tell me we go back to Ellie now. Shit! What about this one? When I was 12, I found a skateboard. Uh-oh. And I tried to get on it. <laughs> and it shot right out from underneath. I swear to God. <laughs> Wait, how did you get the scar? I fell on my knife. <laughs> Oh, because under the 
Under the tattoo, it looks like a chemical burn. That's so clever. No, wait. Uh... She burnt... It's a chemical burn, and she burnt away uh, the bite mark. That's smart. Okay, I see. Bite mark? Right here. I got jumped by... Oh, I shit. She's... Oh, shit. Yeah, I played the left behind Toblerin. And... And it was heartbreaking. Turns out I'm immune. Andrew, so thank you, Alrethian. With a ring of fucked up teeth marks and cysts and... Ow! Fuck you. Well, hey! <laughs> I told you a real fucking story. I did tell you a real fucking story. Oh, you want a bite mark? <laughs> Do you hear that? Jesse? <laughs> just stay there, okay? Are you just, okay? Just... What's wait, going on? Please. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Are you kidding me? <laughs> You're supposed to be on patrol. There's a blizzard outside. Is that weed? Why are you here? People are counting on you. You get that? What we do matters. Well, then why aren't you at the fucking lookout? Because Tommy and Joel didn't show up. <gasps> oh, God. What do you mean? We waited for them for an hour. I was looking for their horses when I saw lights. Maybe they just went back to town. Without being replaced, no way. How much of their region have you covered? Not much. Then we split up. Go at it from different sides, and we can cover the whole thing in a few hours. I don't like you riding solo. We don't know what's out there. Right, Emily? Exactly. What if they need help? The clothes fell off for like no okay. reason, right? Head west, Dina can take south, and you come from the east, but be smart about it, yeah? Oh, she's worried. It's very hot inside for some reason. I have no idea what's happening. Oh my god, it's so intense. For some reason it's really strange to see people ride horses with like fire equipment. Oh Jesus. Don't waste the ammo! Use like a spear or something! Good night, Owen! Well, that's barbecue time. Jesus. They saved the horse, though. Feeling good about this. How are you guys doing? We're good. Thanks. Yeah. Can I talk to you for a minute? You want to get those saddles off? No, no, it's all right. We'll just ride out the storm. Thank you. Finally, somebody wants to brush and drive the horses. Hey, you have no idea. I don't get electricity. y'all been here since yesterday yesterday yeah what are y'all doing out this way just passing through you two live nearby we do a few hours down the hill y'all should come back with us restock before we head out appreciate it Dennis Driver one congratulations back. Rasmus Tommy this is my brother oh no Joe oh no yeah it's Joel they're looking for like like you heard of us or something. Because they have. Laura, all clear? He's out. Put him against the wall. Tommy. Get off me. Get off me. What kind of bullshit is this?
I was doing a lot better five minutes ago, Rasmus. Yes. Guess? Who the fuck? Why don't you say whatever speech you got rehearsed? Get this over with. Turn to get his leg. Do it. What? Hey, Jaden. Don't you fucking move. God damn it. Mm. Oh, shit. They actually got a real tourniquet equipment. Okay, but like, why are they doing that? It's worse when you know what happened, honey. I can't imagine. You are not. That's some medieval punishment bullshit. What is your. What's the relation here? Why are you doing this? You are wonderful. Oh no, man! Like, Joel! I gotta assume that there's fireflies or something. Oh, shit. How do I get down there? Did you mention hit it because I hit? It? I'm not happy about it either. I'm like, why the torture? Jesus Christ, it's like they've never even read the supervillain handbook. Rule number one, if you got if you got your enemy at your mercy, just execute them on the spot. Joel! Tommy! Don't wax lyrical about it. Joel! Joel didn't deserve that. I don't know, man! What just happened? Tommy and Joel got ambushed, and what the fuck? You're okay. You're okay. I don't think he's gonna be okay. Oh, there it is. Joel? Tommy? I could probably say a lot more, but I'm not gonna do that right now. I'm gonna deal. Fuck. No, wait, I thought that was the downstairs. Oh my god! It's a lot of should haves right now, but nobody knew where this was going. Outside. We didn't think anyone was gonna show up. What the hell did you expect? We gotta get out of here, or the whole town's on top of us. What the fuck? You're done. You want what I want, right? End it. Now. Joel, get up. Joel, fucking get up. Please stop! Please don't shoot! Why with the freaking? Joel, please get up! No! 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 
Why with the golf club? <laughs> and why show me the brain matter? It's so unnecessarily brutal. I talked about this the other day, mm -hmm. Kal-El. Uh, Ellie. Sad things in games and movies don't make me cry anymore. Jesse, that is here. a fucking bomber, man. Welcome to part two. I'll, I'll say, Jesus. This was the worst part to come back to. <laughs> yeah. Those persons are absolutely S tier. Two days straight explosive. I respect that. I'm a little bit sad that I'm spoiler free because Jesus. Cried the first time I saw this. It is very sad. It is very sad. But I don't really cry because I'm sad anymore. Or my my level of sad has <laughs> is all I'm gonna say about it. My level of sad that warrants crying like the threshold has been moved a lot the last few years and that's all I'm going to say about that this is incredibly sad and I'm heartbroken but I cry because things are nice these days higher threshold that's the one nobody was ready for this dude oh Tommy that's your big brother, man. Hey. Could I sit down, please? Oh. Yeah. You are wonderful. DJ Laws and Testy Monkey, thank you so much for the thank you so much for the follows. Never play this game, won't watch the show either. Rio. Too too much emotion. That's completely that's completely okay. Or he wants to make sure you're eating. She can't stop us. <clears throat> they have the guys that we would need to do this smart. We'd be leaving Jackson vulnerable. Oh, he's not going Do after they them. they just get to get away with this? <laughs> Nobody wants that. Yeah, but that's what's happening. What if we get hit by hunters again? Is this you talking or is this her? It's a valid point. If it, it is were a valid you point. Me, Joel would be halfway to Seattle already. No, he wouldn't. He absolutely fucking would be. Well, we don't even know for certain that they're from Seattle. Washington Liberation Front. That's what you said was on those patches. Oh, what shit. Stole those okay. That's... What's the WLF move? What are you doing? I mean, people, people are... You know what? I'm leaving tomorrow. And if you want to come with me, great. You have no idea what you're walking into. You don't know how large that group is, how armed. I don't care. Oh, she is. You can't talk me out of this. Furious. And he's too experienced to be as furious. But there's no way she will, you know. 
She won't hear it. He knows, and he Do also knows that she won't listen. You talk to Maria, okay? There's gotta be some folks you can spare. Yeah, she won't budge. <laughs> well, I'll figure something out. One day. Please. Oh, he cancels the hug because it was close to breaking him. Oh, Tommy, buddy. That would have been okay. Would have been okay to hug and cry, Tommy. But I guess that, I guess he also knew that that would bring him to the, like, point of no return as well, emotionally. She's not going to listen to reason. Yeah, no, for sure. Like, she... She is that she she's not pissed. You know? She is currently in the type of deep dark despair where your own self does not exist anymore. And she has something and someone to blame for being in that sense of despair. That's a terrifying prospect. <sighs> anger, anger is a is an incomplete word. Explosive. When you go through that type of loss, it's uh, it's a pit. That's what it is. She either wins or dies, and she probably feels that either solves the pain she feels. Yeah. Yeah. It's fury. Yeah. No, it's, it's different. It's different. It's a form of rage, but it's like... Despair. Like, when you're so sad that it's just despair. But it's rage. There's no word for it. Stop at his house before we leave. We just have to pick something up. Okay. Abyss. Yeah. Abyssal rage. I couldn't get to the horses. Looks like Tommy took one. Mamma Maria's got the stables locked down. <sighs> Fucking Tommy. Tommy's doing his best, man. Or something. She'll only be filled with blood. Yeah, I. Like, you go this looking for. A lot harder. Then it's gonna be harder. This makes looking it's for something right. to, uh, you know, fill the void. That's the thing, right? I know. And if you think it's blood, might as well try it. I just don't want you to feel like you have to. Allie. You go. I go. Aww. Teenagers. You can watch that Joel scene again? Dude, completely, completely understandable, Snorps. Facial animation? Dude, the facial animations are... I hit it by the east gates. I figured we'd want to see Absolutely beautiful. Dude, how everything is just quiet and beautiful, but you don't really feel like... Acknowledging the beauty of it. Phenomenal freaking writing. Look at how many people Joel helped. Come on now. Come on now. That's how it is, Nanners. What do you need? I'll, I can go get it. I want to do it. Okay. 
Oh yeah, no, it's absolutely S tier. Okay. I'm done, done. I'm okay. Well, that's a lie, Ellie. That is a big fat I'll lie. Thanks. Oh boy. Okay. Man, he had a nice. That's a picture of Ellie and shit. Man! Damn it! Oh no. Oh. <laughs> well, this was not something I wanted today. I like that she draws things. The last was part two installed. What have I been playing up until now then? The hell yeah. I return. Welcome back, Marangana. You just. Um, Marangana, do you want to know what just happened? You can't just. Humor helps. Lying does not, Paprika. But you are right. Because all didn't get a memo, apparently. Hey, Coltuna. Okay. Joel died. He got his head beat in with a golf club. And Ellie is just a different level of sad. And uh, she is planning uh, to get a posse and go out for revenge. The thing, I'm, I assume that the thing happened. Oh, the watch. The watch you got from Sarah. Oh god. A revolver. She's keeping that one. An idiot's guide to sp Oh, that's so cute! Everything okay? Oh man, that was the thing. Yeah. Oh, and he kept he kept the photo. Of course, he kept the photo. And then he has a different photo. Oh no. Well, they had it so nice here. Oh. Oh, don't do the. Oh. That makes it so much worse. I know, Willie. God damn, they wrote this well. Two daughters on the same table. Yeah. Dude. Smell memory? Scent memory? Is so freaking powerful. And he was doing woodworking and shit. Come on now. It's so painful, but it's so well written, dude. The best, the best things be like that. Oh, and that's Tommy and Joel. Oh, oh no. Maria, I'm headed to Seattle. I wish I could let it go, but I can't. I have to bring these people to justice. Oh no, gonna try to Tommy went to ahead? Stop her. Take her guns, lock up the horses, maybe lock her up. Buy me some time so I can end this. Love you always, Tommy. He's gonna get himself killed. He should have yeah, no him. 
You should have given us a group to go after those fuckers. I wish I could. You gotta try to lock me up? I'd prefer that you stay. That's not gonna fucking happen. I'd prefer that you stay, but I know you better. You going with her? Yeah. <laughs> the attitude. I'm just gonna sneak out of here. Hmm? Yeah. On foot? Yeah. I told the stable to let you out with your horse. Grab some ammo too. Thank you, Maria. Just uh, do me a favor and bring my dumbass husband home. And oh, this, Tommy, buddy. Of course. All right. Get going. You're you're losing weight. She's worried about Tommy, man. Tommy wanted to keep Ellie safe. Ran off ahead. Jesus. All right, we need to go make sure Tommy doesn't die because if Tommy dies, I'm, I'm out. <laughs> Jesus. Seattle, day one. Wait, day one? As in day one of the outbreak, or...? This hunter was on top of him, drowning in... Okay, we're on the way to Seattle, okay. Joel couldn't get to his gun. Jeez. Were you scared? Well, I... I yeah, no, for sure, Bacon, just... but... I just ran in there, grabbed his gun, and... shot the guy in the face. How old were you? Fourteen. How old were you when you first killed someone? We talking infected? No. Fully conscious, non-fungal person. Ten? Damn. Wow. What happened? The guy was coming at my mom. I stabbed him. Shit. Well done, Dina. Jesus. He got me beat. Yeah, I'm a real badass. So how lost are we? <laughs> uh, not. Uh-huh. Hey, have a little faith. That's nice. They're talking what about, those about crazy it. You said you and Joel ran oh, the fucking cannibals. You are wonderful. It didn't seem like the same group. Maybe those black market smugglers back in Boston? Do you not? Joel crossed a lot of people. I don't see the point in guessing. Okay. At least. Until we find out. Moving Seattle on horse. I mean, it's not like they're in Seattle right now, I guess. But then again, it seems to be summer, Bacon Addict. So we can assume at least three months. Three or four months. Oh, man. This is gorgeous, though. Look at this. Ellie, cars. Yeah, we're getting close. Start keeping an eye out. You got it. Look at this. God damn beautiful and just honestly the way they did regrowth and revegetation i'm such a big fan 860 miles explosive all right you can walk that a 12 day hike okay here we go guess i was wrong turns out you do know where you're going oh my god this is so cool Dude, look at this. That's the city right there. Look 
look at this. I feel like they assume a lot of bridges collapses a lot faster than they actually do, but I don't know. Old is Elena, 18 or 19, Marangana. They don't really say. They created a program that would accurately predict its growth and patterns. Really? That's cool. Where they go to get that horse and oil change? <laughs> I don't know, Bacon. Where where do you think they would go? 19? Okay. So a month sounds plausible. Yeah, something like that, Angry Midget. Sounds, uh... Sounds more or less... Sounds like an accurate uh, assessment, personally. Alright, time to look for loot! Jesus Christ, though, but it's so well written. Yeah. Didn't you... Wasn't I supposed to leave with some ammo? Game? <laughs> Shouldn't I just have a bunch of ammo on me? I guess not. At least I got full health. <laughs> yes. Yeah, no, no worries, Tactical. If you find it, you can share it in the Discord. If you don't find it, that's okay as well. You're all good, buddy. You just rest up. Do your thing. Alright. Hmm. Welcome to Seattle. Great. Flip it. Ooh. Alright. Well, it's not like we're getting a... It's not like we ever use the maps we find in these games, so I don't know. Well, what the hell? Anything good in there? Found an old tourist map. Well, that's something. That's something. Also, what what can you do in Seattle? Like, is there any reason to go to Seattle for like a tourist trip? I don't know anything about Seattle, which is why I'm asking. It's like 12 degrees and sunny today. Hell yeah, Erasmus, get that spring weather. <laughs> Ugh. Jesus, my my brains my brains is not okay, guys. I gotta say, this game hit me right in my feels. It's called Seattle, so I guess you can see Adel. I mean, a friend of mine's name is Atler. Atel. So uh, you know. <laughs> Number one thing to do in Seattle is leave. All right. Thing was pretty nice. <gasps> do you get some sun, Rasmus? Yeah. Some direct sunlight. Freaking first outdoor beer of the season. Because if you did, I'm jelly. I'm jelly banali. Outdoor Pepsi Max. Good enough, man. Good enough. Nice. Ice cold glass of Pepsi Max at a bag. In the sunshine. Mm, mm, mm. Love it. How them feels going, Hunter? I I am so mad. But now we gotta save Uncle Tommy. We would like to keep you you shut your mouth. I can be in direct sunlight. Thank you very much. Let's try to top the starting gut punch from part one. I mean, they they were really good though. Angry Midget, because they, they like really pumped the brakes on it. I I thought it was like they they had a slower start to this than Whoa. they did. Set the QZ. Yep. Watch the high spots. Like they, they took their time starting it. Like and really hitting you. <laughs> compared to the first game. The first game was like, here's a game, here's a girl. Here's a Joel. Here's the start of the zombie apocalypse. Fuck your feelings. <laughs> but here I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna go around. People are gonna have a nice time. You know, gonna, you know, there's gonna be a little bit of a so society here. It's gonna be uh It's gonna be some steak sandwiches, some venison. People are just gonna run around and you know do things. And it's gonna be kind of nice and. You know, some infected, and oh yeah, we're just murdering Joel. Yeah, okay. 
So yeah, I'm not happy about this. An aversion to aspartam. What's aspartam? Oh, fake sugar. Aspartam is a sweetener agent. I mean, listen. Tactical. Honey. Honey is a great sweetener. Oh yeah, they got the Cordyceps uh, Fast and Agile. Do not let them swarm you. Environment to hide and ambush. Freeing the flank and attack from behind. Check your surroundings. Completely blind acute hearing. Are extremely lethal. Dangerous evolution of stage 3. Strong capable of throwing acidic projectiles. Yeah. There they are. Anything good in there? Pretty picked over. Damn it. Check it all. Check it all. I need all of the loot. You create like a medicine against the infection by night? Nope. They wanted to use Ellie for it, but we all saw how that went out. Soldiers had them in Boston too. Because, uh, you know, Ellie would have died if they did that. And, uh, like, they just said that they could make a cure. You don't kill a 14-year-old girl on could. You don't you don't kill a girl out of could. That is like nah. You don't murder people in the name of science on the off chance that you're able to create a cure, you know what I mean? Sparingly, of course, nice. Honey is an S-tier freaking sweetener sweetening agent. Gotta say. Very nice. Can we climb up here now? Just like whoop. Nope. Okay. That's that pull out. Cool. So uh, yeah, the ladder thing over there. Put yourself in the situation of these people. Yeah, but like, you know. Also, if we're gonna if we're gonna if I'm gonna put myself in the if I'm gonna, I talked about this already, right? But if I'm gonna put myself in the situation of these people, you want to keep the carrier of the antibodies alive. Why? In case you don't figure it out right away, and there's more antibodies to go and collect. Instead of killing the host, producing the antibodies. Because. At that point, if you don't, if you haven't even considered that angle, I have no faith in whoever was working on that shit as a medical professional. You dig? <laughs> I guess we're supposed to try and climb up there. Right? Gotta be. So how do we get there? Oh yeah, via the holding cells. That that makes sense. I'm not saying to kill Ellie, I'm just saying they're desperate. Yeah, yeah, and I get that. I get that tactical. I'm just saying, you know, they should they should have tried to just, you know, scrape it. You can scrape things off the brain without injuring the brain. But nah nah, they just went. We we have to kill the girl. Oh, Oh, we're so sad about having to kill this girl for a chance of creating a cure. I mean! Actually available supplements, IRL. Supplements? The fungus was in her brain, but mutated and therefore ground her. Exactly! They could have harvested it! But they could have harvested, you know... The chemical or the thing that made her immune, you know? Dina, help me up here. Okay. Plot shenanigans. Oh, yeah, most definitely. Most definitely plot shenanigans. Especially since you only have found one person. Exactly, Angry Midget! Listen, I'm, I'm, I'm just still salty about it, you know? I'll keep an eye out. Just see if you can get the gate open from the other side. Sounds good. That's all I'm saying, right? I'm not saying, like that joe should have killed the doctor you know but he must have been a pretty shit or like that doctor was not a research doctor because if that doctor had been specialized in medical research 
he he would not have made that fucking decision. <laughs> Boost engine strength, improve immunity, enhance kidney function. Okay. Improve sexual dysfunction. Interesting. Ours would only possible if there would be somewhere you can reach it without digging into the brain. If it wasn't the case, really. You can literally harvest things out of the brain with freaking syringes, though, Coronastern. Listen, all I'm saying is they at least should have asked Ellie. You know, Ellie wasn't given a choice. Ellie passed out and they just prepped her for surgery. At least ask her. You know. Imagine how boring that ending would have been. I mean, Snorps. It would have made it, you know, impossible to make a follow-up, Snorps, and it would have probably made it a game that people were less enthusiastic about. But, uh... It could have been a good... It could have been a good ending, as well. What would have been fun, though, honestly, is if they... Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. Snorps. Imagine, imagine this, okay? They get to the Fireflies hospital, you know? They do take a sample of Ellie's brain, but they're unable to figure shit out, right? And then the next time she goes under and they're like, we're just going to harvest a little bit more of the, you know what I mean? And then they tell Joel, yeah, we're just going to take the thing out and, you know... <laughs> And then you go on a rampage. So you get like 10, 15 minutes of just chilling and imagining what the world is going to be like when you find a cure. But then again, you know, just from a writing storytelling perspective, that makes it less exciting because you're still going to ask, you, you still need to ask yourself if what Joel did was right. You know what I mean? Yeah, Hunter, precisely. There are a few possibilities why they couldn't, but also because they were fucking stupid, because the real researchers were dead. That's also a possibility. Also, you know, you gotta, you got, you gotta respect the rule of cool, Coronastern, and that's most likely the reason. They just yada 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 a lot of it, and then uh, they decided to make it so that. Uh, you know, Joel had to make this choice and uh, people can talk about whether or not they agree with uh, w with that choice for the rest of their lives. It's that guy who got bitten by the lab monkey. Yeah, right, Ellie? That's honestly what it sounded like. The reason was just because it was. It was annoying as hell. Yeah, let's break some rules. Any any loot? Any loot? Dun -dun. I still go back and forth on the Joel is right or not. I did honestly. Oh wow. Okay. I wonder when this was written. West or over? Got a big operation coming up, and Isaac wants us to go in downtown, taking a gas from the courthouse garage to the dome and taking it to the safe house. Saravina. Okay. That's something. Cool. Um, Snorps, on uh, on my YouTube channel, on YouTube Gaming, I have uh I have uh I have a video about this. I have a video about this where I where I talk about what I personally think what uh, The Last of Us One is about. What the moral, what the story of the, like, message of the first uh, game is. You can watch it in its entirety, but to summarize it, I believe that the message of the first game, uh, the theme, the entire thing, is love. Because Joel is willing to let humanity burn and die and disappear to save Ellie, right? The Fireflies are willing to straight up murder a 14-year-old girl 
on the off chance That's a generator. that it might produce a cure for them, you know? And uh, that's what makes it so great. And the message that, you know, humans are not bad, but they can be absolutely terrifying if you threaten something Shit. that we love. Okay. That's the short version of the video. Still though, please, please watch my, please watch my YouTube videos, guys. I think they're pretty cool. Uh, joking, not joking. Humanity is fucked up in certain aspects and anyway. we're not, we're not. We're just human. With all the beautiful, terrifying, creative, destructive, entire range of contradictions that makes humanity just absolutely magical. But what we do that animals don't do is that we love. Animals care about each other, but they don't love. In that aspect... Oh, I need to switch it. Are you kidding me? Uh, that's what we do that animals don't do. And uh, that's what makes humans truly terrifying compared to animals. <laughs> now, how long is this? Really? God damn it. Alright, we need an extension cord? Extension cord? Go through here. God damn it. Let me climb. I am assuming. I've played video games before. This looks like a job from for climbing all over the place. But where do I climb up? Nope, okay. It's not there. Hello. Extension cord. It's not there. Bill did make a point in this universe's scenario. As much as those things scare me, at least they're predictable. People terrify me the most. He's proven to be wrong though, Hunter. You know, he decides to isolate himself, himself from humanity. You know? And he is all the more lonely, sad, confused, and just in general not a nice person for it. You know what I mean? My point is, humans are not as bad as, you know, certain media, The Last of Us included wants us to seem also hey poetic that humans can hate animals don't hate yet can be shown to show love yeah but it, it's they show affection poetic you know also animals like if if you give animals the ability to love then you also have to give them the ability to hate you know what i mean Bill is how Joel would end up if Ellie didn't come into his life. That's that's uh, that's a pretty good uh, that's a pretty reasonable assessment. My point is, human beings are not as bad as certain popular culture wants us to seem. Sure, there are people that are tricked into believing certain terrible stuff that makes them do terrible things to one another. But for every person like that, there's, you know, a hundred people who just want to go to work, have a good time, go home, be with their families, and take care of those around them. Now, where the fuck? Oh, wait, maybe I need to flick it loose from here. No? Nope, that's not it. 
This is the generator, and I need the generator for reasons. For all great ideals and events, the laws of physics demands an e uh, equal and opposite, an opposite and equal action. I mean, sure, but you, physics. Like, you're applying math to emotions, and that's not the quantifiable entity. But listen, if you want to be cynical, go right on ahead and be cynical. I'm going to be here, and I'm going to be positive. I'm going to be hopeful. Now, do I care enough to... have this conversation every single time people want to justify their cynicism? No. So have fun with Everything it. okay? What was that sound? I got that gate open. Gotta figure out this one now. Well, we believe in you. I have a graduate yes. paper that argues that, and I even managed to get five professors to approve it for my masters. What, that animals can show love? Or that for every person that hates, there are a hundred people that loves? Well, the total damages of replacing my pens. Well, it's probably going to be expensive because the USA doesn't have a functioning welfare state. Oh, I'm supposed to go through here. Uh, that makes more sense. That physic physics laws can apply to emotions and human behaviors. I mean, it kind of. Sp I mean, you can you can make the argument, but I feel like. A shit ton of philosophers and psychologists and anthropologists and sociologists would have an equal, once again, an equal amount of studies that would show that, you know, it's not that easy to quantify it. You know what I mean? Like, for instance, the people are like, oh, people are, people are, you know, terrible. It's like, okay, but like, in every single natural disaster thing that happens, people tend to err on the side of helping each other out and be nice to one another rather than, you know, the terribleness that we ascribe to uh, semi apocalyptical situations. <laughs> You know what I mean? So, uh, I'll be here in my hopeful little bubble. Thank you very much. And How's it going? Well, I didn't really find an extension cord. I found everything else except an extension cord. Extension cord. So, like... Uh, needs juice. Yeah, I know it needs juice, but, like... To be honest, we never had a zombie apocalypse, but Pentagon has a plan for it. And as in numericans, the verbal semantics of laws. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, poetic. <laughs> hey, what's up? All right, I got you. Cold Jesus watch. Christ. It looks pretty long. How did your Maybe professors even deal with you? <laughs> Maybe. That's awesome. What'd you say? I didn't hear what you said. I'm gonna be one of the first to die? Nah. Can you get it over? Oh, over the... Oh, is that... Oh, yeah, true, because I, I threw something. Earlier. Right, right, right. I'm an idiot. Woohoo! See? I would have tried that in real life very fucking early. But in a game, you need to kind of know the game mechanics and remember them before you pull some shenanigans off. You know what I mean? And let's be real, it's still not long enough. <laughs> okay. Verbal semantics of physics, physics and uh, mathematics, I, I mean. Honestly, it's one of the most annoying words. Oh shit. Uh, where was the... Checkpoint gate codes. There we go. Uh, 
Which... Which gate is this? Gate O... Gate D2. Which gate is this? The electrician's gonna be like, please no. <laughs> Which gate is this? Main gate, north gate, east two or west two, I suppose it would be. So five, three, four, five. Five, three, four, five. We're gonna try that first. Five, three, four, five. Damn it! All right. I'm gonna read it again. O four five one. Highly underrated. If you can't describe a concept and explain it even to yourself, is it much use? I mean, that's true. O four five one. What am I missing? Oh, oh! It says main gate, like some, like some idiot. O five one twelve. If only there was a sign about the button. But I. Uh. You are wonderful. Yes. Well done. I literally just thought that that meant Shit. that it was the button for the gate. Hey, come on. Uh. Let's get out of here. Thank you, though, One World. <laughs> the last boss fight in Hogwarts Legacy was awesome. I mean, a good, a good, a good boss fight is good. You can give concepts, words, and understanding. It helps yours uh, and others see it more clearly. You know, like, like, from other conceptions. I mean, true. It also makes you absolutely insufferable <laughs> when you can li when you can literally argue physics, but semantics. <laughs> Also, K Balls, thank you so much for that follow. You are wonderful now and welcome what? to the wholesome order. I found a note back there. Had some codes on it. it says there's a WLF safe house at some That's great, Rasmus. Saravina base. Saravina. So Technically correct is the best kind of correct. Depends on the field. Alive. Get them to talk. Go from there. Let's do it. This is the non negative aspect of semantics that most people forget exists. That's fair. Semantics are frustrating, but sometimes they are oh so necessary. That being said, though, I guess you can technically be like quantify as in count. Oh shit! Look, Saravina Hotel. That's gotta be it. You can quantify as in count emotions with uh, EEG scanning. Okay, let's find a way past. This, we do it uh, a lot at work. <laughs> Fedra gate. Very creative. Gets right to the point. Well, let's get closer and scope it out. And this is census. Okay, ten expel, expel, blah, blah, blah. Continue to have the expression, supply lines, the infected attacks, more information, are still unable to meet. Weekly food distribution quotas. Seal the new entrance, no the floor notice, seize the burden on the food stock, step your switch for criminals, okay. I like that these guys expel them instead of murdering Idiots. them, though. It's turning everyone against you. Even the word semantics has lost a lot of its meaning due to negative connotations that have been applied to it. As long as you don't, uh... oh, we're we're not we're not getting on the horse. All right, cool, great. Okay, here we go. <laughs> nope. <laughs> it's out of gas. Damn it. 
Well, what do we do now? I guess the problem oh, arises. The note. What? The note mentioned that there's gas in the courthouse garage. The problem arises the when dome. people are more right. concerned with winning a discussion so what's the plan rather for than learning from the discussion. We ride around and see. Or just having a discussion. Because honestly, there are two things that annoy me to no end. It's number one. You make a statement. You get pushback on that statement. So you move the goalposts in order to make it fit your original statement and make it harder for people to disprove your original statement because you move the goalpost for it. And then they do that and then you keep moving the goalpost. You know what I mean? And then people start calling out the words like what you actually said and you just keep moving the goalpost in order to maintain your correctedness. You know what I mean? That one and... Uh, like, like what you mentioned, uh, Poetic. Uh, like what you mentioned, Poetic, where... Uh, the Like the negative connotation for semantics. As in, they try to catch you on improper use of a word. And that is just... Oh! Semantics? That must be hard. That does sound very hard, Paprika. Uh... What what are you what are you talking about strictly? I'm I'm not sure what Pretty you're saying sure strictly. We're here. Ah, oh, nice. We'll mark it up as we go. And also, I would. Biothesta where? Yeah, I was memeing Ben Shapiro. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Because my first instinct was like, because you covered it in chocolate and went to the gay club. <laughs> I'm guessing the military bombed the shit out of this place. Why would they do that? Well, they would sometimes destroy parts of the city that were lost to the infected, or to rebels. Uh, like ben, yeah, know. Ben Shapiro is one of those dudes that makes it seem it like worked. that's how you should argue for things, and it's just Both. we're not gonna get partisan shit. up in this bitch, but Believe like. Me. You're lucky you didn't grow up in a QZ. I'm starting to get that impression. Let's just like let's just leave it at. Probably just become. If you lose an argument, soldier. you didn't lose an argument. You I found an opportunity to learn yeah. new things. Good point. I gotta say, I was expecting the Seattle QZ to be a lot more occupied. Just yeah. just learn from it, you know. Hiding at the Serabina. He likes to use hypothetically to use as an argument. Hypothetically, what if there's a situation where you're wrong and I'm right? How can you use hypothetics as an argument, though? And I know Poetic Wine most likely has a... Like, he has a really great answer to on how to use hypothetic as an argument. But, like, if you say, let's say, hypothetically, that blueberries are green. Like, how is that an argument? Sick. It's like, okay, what? let's just assume that the world doesn't work the way it works. Can you tell? She sounds a little hoarse. Then I'm right. Uh, come on, that was a good one. I mean, even by all means, discuss hypothetics. Hypothetics is... Hypothetics is great. Hypothetics is fun. Like, hypothetically, how big is the biggest animal... You could beat in a fist fight. No, no tools, no, no weapons, no, no like human ingenuity. You just straight fists, claws, and you know, uh, teeth. You know, pure just animal versus animal. That's a that's a great that's a great hypothetical. You know, good for debate or discussion, not an argument. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Oh wait, are we supposed to go under here? We're actually using we're actually using the map, are we? Okay, well. If we keep talking, it might get a little hoarse. What? Don't leave this area too quickly. No, I'll I'll do my best. I'm I'm just explore exploration. I mean, sometimes, sometimes semantics are important. 
You missed the joke? Oh. We missed the pun in the game? What? Shimmer's getting a little sick. Oh shit. I was I was too caught up in my own monologue. <laughs> Got a caravan up ahead. I went down here. It looks like an ambush. Check out the bullet holes on the side of this truck. Bullet holes? I don't see no bullet holes. Yeah, whatever. Okay, so I guess we can't make it that way. Anyways. Man! I missed the quality hey, pun! I think I found the courthouse. How can you tell? That's a bummer. Um, see that sign up there? On the building that says courthouse? Oh, well, nice work, detective. <laughs> Mark this place on the map. There we go. An ant. I know I can beat up an ant. That's that's fair poetic. But since we're arguing semantics, uh, an ant is not an animal. It's an insect. Shimmer is sounding a little hoarse. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. One world. Yeah. Strictly. Let's let's not get into it. Nobody wins if we start getting into. Like, that shit always ends with me having to ban people because they're stupid. And I don't feel like doing that today. But, actually, I feel like this is a good place to end today's stream now that we have a bunch of stuff to uh, explore. Insects live matter. Yeah, they're delicious as... Uh, they're delicious as flour for making protein pancakes and shit. <laughs> All right, we got the auto save. That is great. Guys, thank you so much for your company today. We're going to Oh, we're going to listen to uh yeah, we're going to listen to the Halo theme. Oh, indeed, we're going to listen to the No, not the Halo theme. The There we go. There we go. We can grill them as well. Five right, locusts dipped in honey. So good. It's so good. Wonderful. Guys. Oh my god, I need to turn your ass off there we go guys thank you so much for joining me today yelton herb thank you so much for that follow you are wonderful and welcome to the wholesome order we are about to embark on a crusade of kindness which is of course what we call our raids thank you curly you're amazing and once again congratulations so much on your freaking on your freaking partnership Guys, copy-paste the raid message right there in chat, either the sub message or the follower message. And we are about to find out who we should go and say hello to. I think we should go over and say hello to the magnificent, talented, impeccably gorgeous and hilarious bear boo she is currently streaming the beautiful game known as goldeneye and honestly i just want i just want some of that nostal nostalgia right in my face this game is a roller coaster and a half but i am so glad that i'm able to share it with all of you guys i will see you all tomorrow for more The Last of Us action. So if you want to be here, uh, you know, click that little follow button. That's from Lord of the Rings. Yes, it is, Rasmus. Click the follow button. Uh, find us on Twitter. Find us on YouTube. Find us on all the good places for content. And I'll see you all tomorrow, my dear, dear friends. Join the Discord if you feel like it. And with all that being said, have a great rest of your weekend. Have a great start to your week. Stay fantastic, stay amazing, but most importantly, stay kind. And always for remember, you are somebody's knight in shining armor. You are literally making somebody's life better just by you being you. And I think that's a beautiful thing. I'm proud of each and every one of you. And I like you just the way you are. I'll see you tomorrow, my friends. Have a good Sunday. Let's go.